What's up? What's happening? What's good? Yeah, it's Dark Souls 2 today. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, we're gonna continue doing the push-ups. Yeah. <laughs> Might as well. We're doing it the whole marathon. Not continue. Not the one. Go back. It's fine. We're not gonna die a single time. I don't plan on dying. We'll be okay. We're gonna use all the swords. Ah, uh, Mikius, what's going on, man? Isn't my favorite Australian? Perhaps Should be everybody's favorite. Maybe in a dream. We're gonna use. There's only four curved grade swords. Um. Wow, you we my dude. Why do I even have TTS on stage? Why do I? Why do I bother? Hot and special dance partner. We always have fun together and you are a good companion. Laughter invigorates my health and hopefully yours too. There were lots of laughs. Cool. What the fuck? Go away. Why did my shit just... There we go. Everything is fine. Finally playing a true game? Yeah. Where are my glasses? Holy shit. I can see again. Murph! What's going on, man? How are things? Hope you're doing well. I'm trying to like read all the fucking chat. I can't see shit. This is so much better. Which Dark Souls is my favorite? Probably Dark Souls 3. Yes, indeed. What's up? Not much. What's the name of the character? <laughs> Upside down, man. Uh, Fishman, what's going on? I think I already said hi. I don't know. Points inflation? I need to make them more expensive. Clearly. I am doing push-ups, yes. Curved foreskin. Curvy. <laughs> Curvy it is. <laughs> Iwootism. <laughs> Iwootism is crazy. Okay, so we're gonna need like a quality based build. We're not gonna go with like any buffs. Maybe just like pine resin. We're not gonna go like dark or anything like that. We're not gonna infuse it. Cause I'm gonna use all three and I'm obviously not gonna get enough stones to infuse three different things or four different things. So we're just gonna go with the quality build. Cause I kinda want a power stance as well. Seems like the warrior is on the menu. Unless. We go with the knight. Yeah, we go with the knight. Fuck it, why not? Um, Bonfire aesthetic, just in case. And... Face, random. Ah, uh, Skygo, what's going on, man? 
I forgot how shit the chat UI was on YouTube. The chat UI? Is it shit? That's a bit too, um... Maybe offensive. <laughs> Can we change the color of the skin? <laughs> Why does the random always have to default to whatever? We're gonna be black today. It is what it is. Fantastic. Um, where am I going? This is my true self, yes. All people come here. <sighs> I need to play the Dark Souls games, addicted to Elden Ring? Maybe you should. I'm trying to watch me and the UFC 300. What a handsome fella, true. Ah, uh, Nizo, what's going on, man? What's up? Okay, so... So the first... Hmm. Okay, so the first, um, what do you call it, Curves Great Sword that I can acquire is probably going to be off a boss soul, off the Flexile Sentry. So it's either I go kill the Dragon Rider and kill the Flexile Sentry to go get the Arc Sword, or I just use Cheat Engine to drop the Mirakumo, and I just use that for the first part of the playthrough and then get the Arc Sword. Because the Arc Sword is just like better than the Mirakumo. So do I just use the Mirakumo first? With Cheat Engine and then use the Arc Sword later? What do you guys think? Cheat Engine, Mirakumo and Alvis at the whole run. <laughs> Seems like a valid... Valid strategy. Smelling on pasta? What do you mean? Why do you sound disappointed? Because I didn't want you have that to be black. Uh, yes. I wanted my character to be like pink or something. Do. There. Maximum annoyance, no cheating. I mean, the thing is, there's no point of using the mirror Kumo because, like, the Arc Sword is basically the exact same moveset. You feel me? In a rush. It's just worse. I think it's lighter though, and less requirements. So I, I probably use Cheat Engine, because you get the Mirakuma of Orn effects, which that's... I can get there. No, I can't get there early, I lie. I lie. I lie. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay. Can you walk around the thing? To a playthrough of Elden Ring on mouse and keyboard? I don't know about that. I ain't know about all that. Curved Great Swords are so fun. Curved Great Swords are really good in every game, yeah. Only thing that I don't like about Curved Great Swords in this game... Um... It's probably... Their counter damage. They only get like 110 counter damage. Just kind of mid. Which is just as much as a scythe, but thankfully they actually get good poise damage. Look at that, you can two hand your bare fist. Incredible. My character is like ink black. Just. Okay, let's go drop the Alverset. No, don't open Discord. That, that was a mistake. Go away. Slide over. Went to open cheat engine. Alva Helm. Why is every single game UI just different? I don't understand. <laughs> every single game UI has to be different. So you're trying to toggle between all of this stuff. It's gonna make me fat roll anyway. I know I'm doing this. Oh no, Wii Remote. <laughs> There's no curved greatsword on Bloodborne that we're going to be playing with. Well, what's the closest thing to a curved greatsword on Bloodborne? Bro, I keep doing this. Hmm. 
How do you plan out your video um, videos? I just think of them and be like, that's a cool idea, we'll go do that. <laughs> Basically. Sometimes it will be like a day before. I don't like have like an itinerary. Sometimes I have like a list of videos that I want to go do. At the moment, I've kind of done all the things that I want to do. So now I've got to think of a new like idea, so to speak. Why is it that Cheat Engine drops this shit at like less vitality or less um... Oh, it's about like 50%, that's fine. Less in uh, durability, I mean. Maybe after putting the Murakumo, that's gonna change. Murakumo. Twin Blade Marathon? There won't be much, yeah. It would just be three games if I did a Twin Blade Marathon, but I could do Twin Blades. Ew, I'm fat. I can put on the helmet at least. Oh, no, I can't even put on the helmet. I can put on the gauntlets at least. Hell yeah. Things are looking good. Here to support the stream and drop a like. Nice. A pickaxe marathon? The hunter scythe? Uh... Nah. More like regular curve swords. You going to be buff at the end of this? Am I? Whip marathon? Once you have to see light, however. A whip marathon. No. I don't think people want to see me rank the whips, I'm not gonna lie. Do we sleeper build? Sure. Bro, come on. Switch to the thing. Thank you. <laughs> it's not that hard. Alva is peak fashion. It is really cool. I do be liking the color red. Um, okay, let's just go kill the Dragon Rider. Get the Dragon Rider souls. The thing is, curve great souls always have high strength requirements, but they always scale up dexterity. Marathon, dollar bills face. Dollar bills face. Dollar bills face. Fire. 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 Dollar bills face. I didn't change it to where, like, face, Brian doesn't fire, say the fucking emojis arrow, in TTS. Arrow. That's so stupid. Next person that puts emojis in TTS, timed out. Not doing a level 1 broken straight sword marathon. <laughs> That's not happening. Walk marathon with only kick attacks. No. No. And if the next video that I have planned, or next something that I wanted to do, I was top 10 early game Elden Ring weapons. Like, top 10 weapons early game for Elden Ring. However you're gonna say it, I don't know. What are you guys' thoughts on that? I've kind of done, like, all, like, the good ideas. There's nothing left. All of the good ideas that I have left are stuff for up. Can I stop getting hit? Um, the only good ideas I have left are like the Soulsborn ideas, of which I kind of want to do marathons if I'm going to do those ideas. Wee! Oh, I shouldn't have jumped there. I had to do push-ups. Did a baby jump. I forgot I have to be paying attention. I can't just play willy-nilly. Oh, god damn, I wasn't expecting to die this early. I don't have to get up in my fucking chair, I'm all comfortable as well. Uh, are you even gonna do the push-ups? I'm gonna do the push-ups. I did 150 yesterday, hence the number right there. We're doing it for the entire marathon. Blastmas Blade is gonna rank number one now. It's not an early game weapon. If I'm gonna do that a list of like the top 10 early game weapons, I'm gonna just make it casual friendly. So like it's very easy for casuals to get. So I probably like before the Altus Plateau and you don't have to kill a hard boss to get it. So I'll probably be for like noobs. It'll be like a noob video. I actually might make that. I might make a noob video. Why not? Because most of my content's always for like seasoned veterans, so to speak.
I should end the stream right now. I should end the stream. This is not a good sign. The fact that I fell straight off the ledge. This is not a good sign. 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 I should I should just start again tomorrow. I should just start again tomorrow. Because I think I wasn't even counting his steps or even paying attention to where he was, and I kind of just ran. And like the fog gate was kind of blocking my camera a little bit, and I guess I took too far of a right. Clearly. Damn. That's not good. <laughs> okay, concentrate. Concentrate. This cannot be. <laughs> not good. We've done 20 push ups. I haven't even killed anything yet. I've just started. It's been like five minutes. This is okay. Oh, this is not good. And he's not even falling off. Just fall off. Thank you. Everything is part so far. <laughs> okay. I gotta Just concentrate. Go I gotta like not not be stupid. That's the strategy. Ah, uh, burn and it's gonna miss. <laughs> okay, it's two deaths to full damage. Or just jumping off a cliff. That's pretty good. Um, I don't need you for anything, so you're gonna die. I might need your souls. Oh, I have no choice now. I have no choice now. Unarmed marathon when? I have other ideas for marathons and it's not going to be anything that you guys recommend. <laughs> not going to be anything of the sort. 10 push-ups is too little. The amount of times that I'm dying- I've already died twice. <laughs> I've done nothing. I have to do 20 push-ups already. I don't watch UFC. I don't care. Okay, let's do 20. Easy 20. Good start to the stream. Fantastic. This is so fine. Light work. Light work. Light work. My arms are still hurting from yesterday. My shoulders are kind of, I can still feel it. It's 170. That's fine. Okay. Fuck. What's the requirements? 20 strength. I can two-handed at this level, can't I? No, I can't. I have 11 strength. I need 14. And I need 20 dexterity. How am I going to get there? Why do curved grades have such high strength requirements? Oh. Favorite weapon in this game? Probably the red iron. Actually, the bone fist. Bone fist or the red iron twin blades? Either or. <sighs> 15 deaths. I mean, I died 15 times in Dark Souls 1. That's why it's counting my run from yesterday. <laughs> 20 dexterity. Perfect. <laughs> we now have enough. Yeah, I'm gonna get the DLC one. Oh, we're gonna have to play the third DLC. This is an absolute travesty. This is so fine. This is not even a big deal. This is so fine. What are you guys even worried about? This sucks.
Yeah, we're gonna have to play with all the curved great swords. So we're gonna use the mirror Kermo. Um, probably kill like the first few area bosses. So kill kill this boss. Probably go kill. Um, probably up until the lost center. Might be the strategy. And then we're going to switch to the Arc Sword. I kind of want a Power Stance, but like with how... How like high the requirements are for strength. It might be like later in the playthrough. Wait, does the um the, curse, the Curved Neil Sword, does that actually have... A unique Power Stance in Heavy Attack 2 or no? It should have one, right? Is it like another spin to win? What is with the hit detection? Am I bad at the game or is it just like... Just went straight over his head. Horseback, Horseback Valley is easy with a large club plus 8. You can get it. Has a unique power sense two-handed, yes. Um... Is it a good power sensing combo? We might just get power sense like later in the playthrough. We'll just go leave it turned for now. Not that I have any other option, but curved great swords are bad in this game. They're not the worst. They're not as bad as scythes, but like they're probably outclassed by a lot of other dexterity weapons. Probably mainly katanas. I just wish I had higher counter damage, you know. It's just like the requirements and the counter damage just kind of like what fucks them. But they're not bad. Definitely a lot better than Scythes. Compared to Dark Souls 1? Um... Maybe Dark Souls 1's are better. Maybe, yeah. Maybe. I missed. Heal. This is very dangerous. We cannot die here. Oh, this makes no sense. Bro, I hate <laughs> everything. This is why I just run. This is why I just run. This is why I just run. Yeah, we're winning. We're having a fantastic time already. It's another 10. Are you streaming the Elden Ring DLC on release? Yeah, I will stream the Elden Ring DLC on release. release, yeah. Rip arms, yeah. My arms are... I fucking hate arrows in this. I hate these guys. The fact that they just... Why do they work like that? <laughs> one hand for the- I can't one hand this thing. I don't have the requirements. Okay, I was gonna sprint, fuck everything else. I was gonna try and kill him legit, but... Clearly... We just suck. That's all I had to do, was just run. Losing everything about our virginities? Yeah, probably. Stupid ass game. Five witching urns, it's exactly what I needed. Um, okay. Let me buy one firebomb.
good enough. We're gonna be so fine. This is not even a big deal. How'd you get the Murakumo? Cheat engine. We're gonna decide either just like going to kill a Flexile Sentry, then running to Strayed to go get the Arc Sword right at the beginning. But that means I would have had to kill a couple of bosses without a weapon. Or with like a regular weapon. Um, and the Arc Sword is just like a better version of the Murakumo. So I was like, I might as well just drop the Murakumo with Cheat Engine. Go play with this for a little bit and then switch to the Arc Sword afterwards. But then again, the Arc Sword requires Petrified Dragon Bones. Are the recovery frames that bad, really? They're that bad. Appreciate the banger tier list for Dark Souls 3 weapons. You're welcome. I made a tier list, wasn't it like a top 10? Um, give me that. Get up. Yes, yeah, a flexile sentry sword, yeah. It's like the exact same moveset. But I think it's like a, just a bit heavier, a bit higher requirements, and it just... More damage, though. I don't know if the range is more, though. Might be more. Or the same. There's no way you can block two attacks with a curved greatsword for like a low level... This makes no sense. This guy's shields are broken. Simon Bowblade is like a curved greatsword. <laughs> I know about all that. Lightning infuse all the weapons? Yeah. <laughs> Tis the strategy. Oh, that's so stupid. That one's dumb. I don't like that one. Is the speed of running in all the games the same? I mean, like, similar. Not the same, though. What's going on, Yui? Dang! This is fine. Ah, uh, Merzel's gonna, man. The crouching making stamina fill up faster in Elden Ring? Yeah, the crouching strats, or...? I fucking hate that in... They nerfed that, or they patched the whole, like, stamina regen when spamming crouch while sprinting. That shit was so good. I can't believe they ruined it. Why did they do that, chat? Why did they do that? Okay, so this one is- I think this is the only one that requires Titanite Shards. I think the other ones require... Petrified Dragon Bones. And I think the Curved Nail Sword requires Twinks? That was close. Because Miyazaki hates fun. I suppose. I don't want to die here. Oh, these guys are the worst. Why do they get to block and attack at the same time and block all my damage? <laughs> They're just the worst. Why do they hate me for real? Like, this is low-level enemies. Why do they design them like that? Like, not even, like, the Lothric Knights in Dark Souls 3 have that much stability on their shield. <laughs> Die. Die. These guys are broken.
Anyway, I still think that the Forest of the Fallen Giants has the best level design out of all the areas in Dark Souls 2. I'll stand by that. I'll stand by that. Maybe at least for the base game. Maybe Elium Lois and Broom Tower might have a bit better. Although the enemies are way more obnoxious. Will you turn on PvP? Will I turn on it PvP? What does that mean? I mean, I'm playing online right now. I don't know how to play offline in Dark Souls 2. <laughs> like, where the fuck is the setting? So I honestly can be invaded. And I'm trying to like watch all these cutscenes and shit. We're gonna be here a while. I still gotta do 10 push ups. But... At least my damage doesn't suck. It's just me that sucks. I wasn't expecting. That's fine. The best Souls game in the game, the worst? Uh, I don't know. I like Dark Souls 3 the best, and I like this game the least. But I like them all. They're all fun games. I think they're all cool. Let's not add it to the last giant. That'll be <laughs> that would be tragic. Poor guy. Happens to the best of us. So many mediocre bosses. It do be like that. Indubitably. Okay, let's go spend all of these souls on Melentia. Go get my silver ring. Name one good Dark Souls 2 main game boss. Uh, Smelter Demon. Pursuer. Looking Glass Knight. That's it. Okay, um, Velstad as well, yeah, can't forget Velstad, I forgot. Uh, Lenny Grast Key, give me that shit right there. Um, do I want the Pharos Lockstone? Dark Lurker is pretty cool too, yeah, getting to Dark Lurker is a pain in the peepee hole though. Um, yes. And I'll go by one of these, and that should be 10k right there. Is my math bad? It is bad, yeah it is. That should be 10k. I literally had 10k, I should have spent all this. It's fine. That is okay. Now we have the Covetous Silver Serpent Ring. We have that. Okay, now do I go use the Pharos Lockstone to go get the Chloranthi Ring? I think we do. I think we do. And we'll go kill the Pursuer. That seems like a good solid strategy right there. I hate these guys. Like, every enemy in Dark Souls has like good tracking. It's like really annoying. I'd appreciate it if they didn't have really good tracking. Ew. Nice, huge. Nice, massive. Velstad has like three attacks. I mean like a lot of the bosses in Dark Souls 1, 2 and Demon Souls, they just have like three hit combos. Like they don't have complicated movesets at all. Even some of the DLC bosses are pretty basic. Looking Glass and Velstad just look good, they're not very good boss fights. I disagree, I think they're okay. Don't 
Dark Souls 1 is 3 years older. Um, then this game? Well, 2011, 2014, yeah, I guess. That is definitely 3 years. But they're both in the same generation, like they're both PS3 generation, you know? Like the way to separate the games is like you have Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 2, that's the PS3 era. And then you have Dark Souls 3, Bloodborne, Secular, that's the PS4 era. And somewhat Elden Ring as well, I guess. It's all the same engine. Now it is waiting for the next era. I think the Soul Saga has come to an end. I'm not gonna lie. I think the Soul Saga is finished. I don't think they're gonna make any more games like this. I think they're gonna go like more secular route and go make just different types of games with different like mechanics and things. I think the Souls franchise has basically run its course. I think we've peaked. We can't really get any faster. The bosses can't really get much harder. Like the mechanics, we've kind of come to like a, a conclusion. We're gonna need... We're gonna need like a new engine and we're gonna need like a new style of game. I want us to strafe a bit better. Dark Souls will never die. I think we've peaked. They'll make new games with different styles. Just for the best. Honestly, which is fine, because like, we have like how many games that have this Souls, um, Souls formula? We don't need it anymore. Like, if I wanted to play Dark Souls, I have three games for that. <laughs> I mean, technically, like, fucking five if you include Bloodborne and Elden Ring. And Demon Souls there. Six. We have enough Souls games. Why do I think I can strafe that attack? Happen? What am I capping about? But you guys think- you guys literally think that we haven't like hit a peak with the Souls games? Like you don't think anything past Elden Ring you think it's gonna be like... I don't know, like the bosses have like- I don't know, we kind of peaked. I think the DLC is gonna be like the pinnacle. The hardware is not gonna allow it to go like any further. We're just gonna need a new style of game. Like, it'll still be, like, Souls feeling. Like, the atmosphere will still be the same. Like, combat will probably still feel similar. But I think, like, they, know they need to go more secular route, you know? Just change things up a little bit. Bosses in Elden Ring are awful. That is absolutely not true. They're just overly complicated. It took a while for me to get used to. Like, your first playthrough, the Elden Ring bosses are kind of doo-doo trash. Because they take a while to get used to, but like, Eld Elden Ring bosses are some of my favorite bosses now. I don't doubt that the DLC will have some of the best bosses as well. Like, I don't know, the bosses can't get any more, like, challenging. They're still bad? I wholeheartedly disagree. I think Elden Ring bosses are amazing. They'll keep making them? Yeah, I don't think they're not gonna like, you know, I just don't think it's going to be like the same Souls formula. I think they're going to change up the formula. I think they're gonna go like, secular style. Not exactly like secular, but they're gonna change it up like secular. So it's still gonna feel the same. 
You're going to have, like, React Zone enemies and bosses moveset. But we're just going to have different capabilities. Like, our, the gameplay is going to flow a bit differently. I think this natural progression just works that way. doesn't have to be harder but the thing is if you make a game and make the bosses mo uh, move slower and less complicated it's going to be the same it's going to be the same as regressing so that's why you got to change it up because like now you've taken the formula and you've stretched it out so far and made the most like insane and in bosses like you just gotta you gotta let the formula die you gotta let the formula die Um, I haven't done 170 this stream. I did 150 last stream. I died 15 times on Darks as well. I've died three times. I forgot to do 10 push-ups again. Fuck. <laughs> anyway. Did they can make a better Sekiro? Yes. Sekiro could be way better. Way better. Probably not in terms of boss quality, but definitely, um... Build variety and stuff. The combat can be even better. Just give us more, um... Give us more weapons. You don't need build variety in Sekiro? I mean, you don't need it. You don't need build variety in any game. <laughs> it, just, it just helps. It just makes it more fun. Makes the replayability factor just even better. But yeah, you don't need build variety in any game. You can go pick up a weapon and just go play through the entire game with a club, go naked, and it's gonna work just as well as almost anything else. But it's just... It just makes the game more fun. What am I doing? Mid push-ups? Fuck out of here. Mm -mm. I'm reading my fucking chat, you stupid fucking piece of shit game. Why do you have so many ledges literally everywhere? You piece of shit. Fuck you and everything. Disgusting fucking game. <laughs> I just got up from doing 10. Every fucking time with Dark Souls 2, bro. They put like random holes everywhere. For no reason. I didn't buy a... I didn't buy a firebomb. I should have bought a second firebomb. I keep forgetting. Just walk up the ledge correctly. Remember push ups out? You'll get them in a bit. Fuck off. <laughs> Stupid ass game. <laughs> Hit him from the back. There is a reason. You doing push ups. Ah, uh, cool. Horror Yui. Okay, please explode the barrel. I don't want to run back here. Come on, barrel. I'll do it myself. This is fine. Um, he's sitting on a twinkling tide night, I think, isn't he? <sighs> this is okay. So excited for the Ruin Sentinels. We're not fighting the Ruin Sentinels right now. <laughs> it's not happening.
Quality and simplicity? I agree. I agree. How the curved great souls in this game? They're cool. They work and all. They do their job. They're probably like a solid, like... Solid... B plus tier. Maybe lower A tier. We'll see how they go. Friend of mine is new game plus 40 in Dual Wielder the Neil Swords for the culture. Does mad damage when lightning infused. Yeah, how far does the Neil Sword scale to? What new game? Is it like new game plus 7 or some shit? I don't know. I hope there's more walking mausoleums in the DLC. Yeah, there should be. Although, like, at least there'll be, like, another alternative to duplicate remembrances. That's what I'm thinking. Um, how many do you need? Two more. Oh. I need to get some actual titanite shards. That would help. You're gonna beat the game once for each sword? Now we're gonna use all the swords for the entire playthrough, yeah. Okay, still another ten. Fuck. We've already died... What's that? Four times to full- And every single death was like the full damage. Oh my god. My shoulders are still hurting from yesterday. This is not good. Yeah, we did Dark Souls 1 yesterday. We played through all the Curved Great Swords. They're really good over there. I died 15 times in Dark Souls 1. 150 push-ups were done yesterday. And... I think half of my deaths were to fall damage. And we've died four times so far today, and three of them have been by falling off the cliff. So that's pretty cool. Elden Ring, I'm gonna try my best to do a no-death run. <laughs> I'll try my very best. I'm actually good at that game. I already had six Titanite Shards, bro. I didn't need to do all that extra work. That's fine, I had to come here anyway. Okay, cool. Plus six Murakumo. That's fantastic. Um, let's go pop these boss souls. I kind of want to go pick up some gold pine resin. So do I go down to the gutter? So I get a fragrant branch of yule. Ah, uh, Timothy, what's going on, man? UFC card picks are terrible so far. Your stream is keeping me happy. <laughs> well, that's good. Ah, uh, Raz, what's going on? How are things? The Dragon Greatsword? Or Dragon Curve Sword? Yeah, um... That one is... That's past the Ancient Dragon, right? You need to get the Ancient Dragon Soul? Ugh, that's fine. Um, that's okay. Endurance. Wait, I need that much. Ah, uh, Victor, what's going on, man? What's up? First phase, Ludwig is fucking irredeemable. How does anyone like this boss? <laughs> So there's some there's some attacks of first phase that's kind of really annoying. Especially because it's hard to read the boss's moveset, but for the most part, it's pretty decent. Uh, Come back with the Ashen Mist Heart? Yeah. Oh, so it's in the memory. Fuck. Um, that's okay. Okay, so we go down here. Fuck this shit. Give me that one. Um, we don't need this shit right now. Give me this one. Ew, I'm fat. Oh, I have to go spec into vitality. Oh, that's disgusting. That makes me very upset. Okay, let's just go down. Yeah. We'll go down. Push-ups for deaths? Yeah. We're deciding to do push-ups for the entire marathon. So for every time that I die this marathon, we be doing some push-ups.
Where's Ladderbro? He's not here right now. Ladderbro comes later. I think after like Earth and Peak or some shit. The basic mace is literally the best weapon in this game. Hammers in this game are fucking amazing. But yeah, the basic mace can carry you pretty far. I think the Craftsman hammer is just better. I think it's just more damage. Okay, please don't fuck this up. Chad, I don't want to do push-ups. <laughs> I don't want to do push-ups. I had the cat ring on and I still died there. They have to angle it better. This is so fine. Not even a big deal. It was your idea. Someone said it and I was like, let's do it. Oh my god. Why do I try? That's fine. I need to do push-ups, I need to stop being a fucking dick. Let's do do dum dum. Do do dum dum. I think Ludwig is a fantastic boss fight. I think the first phase can be kind of shit. Depending on your RNG as well. But I think the second phase is amazing. I know when I've been doing these marathons, lately I've been liking Maria a little bit more. But I have some fights with Ludwig, it's like, this is really cool. But yeah, the, the OST is peak. Why did you think you could hit a Dark Souls 2 Crystal Lizard? I don't know. I thought I could get it. Watching the stream on my OLED Switch looks better than my laptop? Maybe it's because it's a smaller screen. Favorite Dark Souls 1 boss? Um, probably Ornstein and Smo, maybe? I don't know. Manus is pretty cool. I like Calamite. Artorius is cool as well. Probably just those three. Fuck the rest. <laughs> three or four, whatever it was. Okay, let's go do another 10. Oh, this is so not good. I can really feel it in my shoulders. This is so fine. I have socks on today. Just in case anybody sees my feet. Planned ahead. We've died 20 times this marathon. This is so bad. Okay. Let's just do a little bit of running. Let's go through this area with great skill. And let's not die. That is, in fact, going to be the strategy. You could do squats. I'm not going to do squats. Number three is Capra. I don't mind the Capra demon. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes I do mind him. Okay, let's just do some normal running. Mind the gap. Walk around to the little ledge. Roll through this. We're gonna be fine. Things are looking up. A poison throwing knife. Very nice. Uh, 
Um, do I just fall off here? Yeah, I do. <laughs> like, being, like, really careful. I'm forgetting what I'm doing. Don't need that. Fragrant branch of yore. Okay, we can go try and go to the shaded woods. And maybe stack up with some gold pine resin. It's probably going to be the strategy. Fuck this area right now. <laughs> What's going on, Yui gang? Ah, balloon is gonna man. How are things? I turn in and I see four deaths all to fall damage. I think it might be a Chris. <laughs> no, I think it's just me. I always die to fall damage. I mean, doesn't everybody die to fall damage? I think everybody does. Actually, I kind of want to kill another boss. And then use those. I have a plus six. I can go kill the flex last entry. He can get fucked up pretty easily. Flex last entry can get fucked up. Let's go do that. Has fallen for the soul series so hard? Why you always ban me? Why I comment on your huge nose? I don't ban you when I'm when you make comments about my nose. I ban you when you get annoying. I don't ban you, I time you out, there's a difference. It's temporary. Fuck him up. Huge damage. Nice. Just died from failing the by right, falling ten times getting down. The timing on the Radon skip. Um, basically, wait, isn't there a, um... That tracking is disgusting. These enemies have better tracking than me, and I fucking hate that. <laughs> as soon as you see the camera, like, pan down, you basically gotta, like, jump again. I think there's a Sublime Bone Dust here. Am I wrong? There is, cool. <laughs> We need all the things that we can get. <laughs> Best shield to have in Dark Souls 2? Adaptability. I don't use shields, go ask somebody else. I don't use shields in any game. Opinion on the Iraq attack on Israel. I don't fucking care, bro. We're playing the Souls game. Got my own shit that I gotta worry about. I don't like war, how about that? There's my take. <laughs> the less people that die, the better. How does Dark Souls 2 affect LeBron's career? <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna play this safe, I'm gonna get a torch. We're going to be responsible and get a torch. This curved greatsword seems to bang hard. It do be banging hard sometimes, yeah. Oh wait, I can't attack with this. I don't have the requirements. I'm going the wrong way. Favorite kind of pizza? Um, I don't know. I like all pizza. I don't think I have a favorite kind. As long as like this different shit. I like variety and everything. I'm not gonna lie. I don't be having a favorite thing. I like anything really. 
It's always good to not have favorites or preferences and a lot of things. It opens you up to more experiences. You don't support the murder of innocent people? That's a hot take? Yeah, true. We go be down. We go be down. Pineapple, I mean, I'm not a fan of mixing sweet things with salty things. That's not me. I didn't be doing that. So, pineapple would not be something that I pick. If I were to pick some pizza, I'd pick something for like meat, chicken. That's about it. Ain't no um, pineapple in my pizza, no. Did I play the Bloodborne remake when it came out like a long time ago? I didn't finish it there. I was like, this is cool, but like, I don't care to play a clunky game. <laughs> like, on purpose, no less. I forgot to fucking save my gameplay for half of these bosses. Fuck. It's fine. Just like the stupid, you stupid. Heal. The curse outside is so cringe. I won. Ali, what's going on? How are things? Melted? Yeah, sort of plus six. Weapon will do. With the um, gold pine resin. It'll be doing that. It's a great game to watch other people play and never touch it myself. What, this game or the Bloodborne remake? You healed against a Flexel sentry. Did you really win that one? Yes, I did. Do I use any mods? No. Yeah, like, I don't know, it just used- the remake uses PS1 controls and I was like, well, this is kind of cool. It's a cool concept. I don't really care to purposely play a game that has, you know, a game with, like, more clunk. It's not for me. <laughs> not for me. Like, I was playing, I was like, why am I playing this? Like, I can just play regular Blood Bowls. <laughs> it's just better. They should do an Elden Ring remake already? Yeah, Elden Ring hasn't aged very well. They should do a remake. Can I play Bloodborne Cut? Of course I am. Seems like an actual good game. It's the better version of regular Bloodborne. Okay, we have souls. Let's go spend them. On probably Vitality, or I don't know what else. We'll see. I like jalapenos on pizza. Same. Spend my souls on drugs. Adaptability. <sighs> the terrible stat. Um. What's my agility at? 90. I need 91. Oh, what a stupid stat. We'll go to 91 and that's it for the rest of the playthrough. I'd like just two more iframes. Oh no, I wanted to save- ugh. The reason I wanted to kill a boss is to save the souls. To buy some gold pine resin. Seek less. Seek, seek less. Okay, 91 agility, good enough. <sighs> I'm pretty sure 91 is the fucking soft cap thingy, I forget. Or one of the caps. Burn the sublime bone dust. I got two of them bad boys, hell yeah. Ah, uh, W, what's going on man? How are things? Some force has strengthened your flask. Chat, should I be a voice actor for some of the Souls games? 
I could be like a companion that speaks to you along the way. No? You guys are fucking haters. You guys are haters. Should voice the maiden? Should I be the femboy firekeeper? Actually, don't answer that question. Um, okay. Next, what we're going to be doing... Do I go kill the Ruin Sentinels? Should voice Mikola. <laughs> Ruin. Ruin Sentinels. Actually, no. Ruin Sentinels are a pain in the poopy hole. Let's go kill the Lost Sinner first. Why do I want to go kill the Ruin Sentinels to get to the Lost Sinner? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Do I kill the... I want to go get... Hmm... I'm gonna kill another boss first. Do I kill the stupid rat? No, the rats are annoying. They can one-shot me. Um. Yo, after using Moonlight in ER, I can't use anything else because everything I can't feels see who the name super that is. bad. Oh, weak! Thank you for the hundred bits. Dot, I want to try something else, but for example, Eleonora does no damage compared to MGs like WTF. I'll answer that question in a bit. I'm just trying to figure out where the fuck I'm going. Okay, let's go kill. Let's go, sir. Skeleton lords. Skeleton lords. This is the strategy. Practice having your mouth move with a zero facial expression. <laughs> That's basically it, yeah. Um, I can't use anything else because it feels super bad compared to the Moonlight Greatsword. Eleanor- the thing is, Eleanor is pole blade just does bad damage. Like, it, there's no other way around it. Like, it does good stance damage, it can bleed build up pretty nicely, but the damage itself is kind of just doo-doo trash. Um... You should use, like... If you want to go, like, an arcane build... I don't know, you, you can go to, like, a jumping attack build. That could work. If you're gonna use Eleonora's, just like, go get like another blade based twin blade and just power stance jumping attacks and then spam jumping attacks the entire time. Claw Talisman, Raptor Feathers chest piece. Go hard. I haven't tried Blasmus. Blasmus is not gonna do as much damage as Dark Moons, but it'll do fine damage. And if you had an intelligence build, you could use like Death's Poker, Wing of Estelle, they can hit just as hard. Um, if you have an arcane build already, go pick up the Mogwin Sacred Spear. That could hit just as hard if you want to have, like, broken damage, and... Use things like that. Death Ritual Spear is really good, too. I've been hit. Are you cultured degenerate? <laughs> I would like to think that I'm not a degenerate. I'm not gonna lie. There are some times at which I do partake in said degeneracy, but I l think I like to steer clear of a lot of those things. We're one-shotting these guys, that is actually mega huge. We might use the Murakumo until we might just get clear out this whole Maybe section. A few months ago was very much a degenerate. Absolutely not. Am I gonna play Stellar Blade? Yes. I'm actually gonna play Stellar Blade. I'm kind of like running low on ideas for content and stuff. When bells were still here. I mean, the chat was just like very horny for like a little bit, so... It just spawned in some degeneracy. Oh, go away. Mirakuma is not an Elden Ring? Yeah, it's kind of shit. Look at this Kraken. Not to get political, but what is Bells? Bells was a... A chatter? that came into this stream. Um, and she was very horny.
Um, the Dismantler is pretty similar. Yes, it's similar, but it's not called the Murakumo, so. Is she still alive? Probably. <laughs> German Slottery. <laughs> Doesn't watch the streams anymore? Because she's a fake Yui fan, that's why. <sighs> Is the Murakumo faster than the Dragon Curved? Um, I think all the speeds are the exact same, right? I think the only difference the Dragon Sword has is the... The heavy attack? Is the AoE, right? Is that the only difference? I think the the curved Nil Sword has a slower moveset. That one's slower. But I think all the other ones have the exact same speeds. I might be wrong. You got played hard? To, or you, you played hard to get so she left? Maybe. Maybe I did play hard to get and so she left. That's fine. The curved Neil Sword is insane, yeah. Wait, how much damage does it get um, with every single new game? Who else kills the merchants every run and doesn't feel bad? <laughs> you should never feel bad for killing NPCs. Ever. Is Dark Souls 3 a good place to start? I always recommend just starting at the beginning. If you really want to appreciate their older games more, you start at the beginning. If you don't care to play all the games, then yeah, I guess Dark Souls 3 is a fine place to start. Because if you go play the newer games and go try back to the older ones, you're probably not going to enjoy them as much. Did Was there only two bonus skeletons? I thought there was a third one. What is this stamina cost? Someone asked me a question and I was reading it and I kind of just like didn't read it out loud that I forgot to answer it. Something about Liza P, and I forgot. Okay, someone asked me a question about like the King's Flame Forker, and I read it in my brain, and then I didn't actually comprehend it and want to answer it. I forgot. Bad streamer. That's what I've been doing sometimes, so like, oh, come on, please. Every time it's like, I'll read the chat, I'll read it in my brain, and then be like, I answer it in my brain, then I don't actually say it, and I'll be like, wait, I forgot to answer the question. <laughs> Pretty stupid stuff. Oh, just leave me alone. Human effigies? Nice. Hopefully, I don't need them. Try Demon Souls, you have PlayStation Plus. It's actually free. Wait, Demon Souls is free with PlayStation Plus? Is it like the regular version of PlayStation Plus or just like a whatever the other expensive version is? I would like to not die. I don't have the chlorine theory on. Fuck. I recently started Lies of P with my friends since I hadn't played since release and I liked it. It is really cool. It's PlayStation Plus Extra. There you go, yeah. So it's the extra version. That makes more sense. Best Soulsborne waifu? Um, I don't know. I don't care. None of them, they all suck. Harvest Valley. <laughs> Solaire. <laughs> okay, let's go spend all these souls on gold pine resin. Yeah. Yui likes men. Sure, buddy. Is it a bannable offense to give Yui stupid names? 
Um, what do you mean? Do you want to call me a stupid name? If you want to. But you might get banned. <laughs> it's the Bloodborne doll? How is the Bloodborne doll a waifu? It's a fucking doll. She has like no personality. Zero emotion. She just sits there and does nothing. How? I have not played Still Rising. I don't really play many Souls likes. I knew Souls like games that have actually finished was Lies of P and Lords of the Fallen, the new ones. She literally exists for our well being and nothing else, that's why. That's boring. Sometimes you want like a bitchy, a bitchy person. More personality. As if these people are not dying in one hit, that's disgusting. See, I would like to kill him, but I don't trust myself. We're going for the kill. That thing didn't die. That's, that makes me very sad. We can kill them. What's the heavy attack combo like? Oh, it's like the ultra greatsword combo. That's not cool. Now I know one of these things, well there's a bonfire here, I know one of these have an Estus Flask shot? Do you have an opinion on durability? I despise it, I think durability sucks. Why do they have huge ball sacks? Maybe because they want to, okay? A roll stone, nice. Hell yeah. Lords of the Fallen felt like such a disappointment. It could have been a lot better. I was like super excited for it, especially after Lies of P came out. I was like, this one has the potential to be even better. It wasn't. It wasn't. A flail marathon while just playing Elden Ring? <laughs> that type of goofy fellow that says zoinks. I died from fall damage. Yes. That is exactly what I say. How did you know that was a part of my vocabulary? How did you know? It's actually the best Dark Souls game? What, Dark Souls 2? Of course it is. What was that ghost that was behind me? It was probably just an NPC. Oh, NPC, the um... An online player. Apparently other people played the game too. Lords of the Fallen was pretty good, though it was released way too early, they've been patching it since launch. I think the game is still foundationally flawed. There's plenty of issues even outside of the performance. Let's do a little running. Happened to the rumor about the Magic FromSoft game? It was proven to be false, but it might still be a thing, who knows. There might be something similar. Every fucking time. Okay, quick, give me some gold pine resin. Oh, this fucking guy's here. Oh, not locking onto an enemy that Dark Souls 2 is like the worst thing of all time. Oh, go away. I just want to. Oh. oh, you disgust me. I didn't want to do that. She's just the worst. Oh, that's some nice knockback. I should be using the heavy attack more. Knock him back. Nice. And again. Oh my god. At least I didn't take damage there. And again. Oh. And again. Can you stop hitting me, please? Wait, don't backstab me. And again. 
I should be like saving this fucking gameplay when I kill these bosses. I've grown. Head, give me some stuff. But I see my, my. And if I can help. Okay, gold pine resin, twenty of them bad boys. Hell yeah, good enough. Farewell. I would like more. Consume skeleton lord soul. Hell yeah. Now we have lots of gold pine resin. Would you look at that? Wait, wasn't there... Hold on. Hold on a second. I want that. Wait, what's the item that's behind here? I think it's like a fire seed, right? I think it's a fire seed. It is a fire seed. <laughs> Using greatsword but zero poise? I have like no vitality. I'm at like 10. I need like level up a thousand stats in this game. All these stats. They need to be leveled up. I know exactly where I'm going. I'm just here to get my plus one chloranthi ring and then I can leave. So I got fall on? Oh. Yeah, fuck fall on. <laughs> but if fall on did have poise, that would have been way worse. Way worse for me at least. I might go work on getting the Arced Sword soon. But the thing is, it requires Petrified Dragon Bones. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna get way more damage with this because, you know... Reasons. Wait, is the Petrified Dragon Bone here, or...? I think it's on that chest. Stop that. We need frigid outskirts too. Surely. Oh, please, just go away. Don't dodge my stuff. Thank you. What build do you think Miyazaki mains? Michael Zaki doesn't play any video games. He doesn't play them ever. Surely not. Isn't the one-handed moveset better? If I had the requirements, I would use it, but... <laughs> I need strength. I need six more points in strength. He doesn't? I think he does play the games. <laughs> I think he does. Tends to be my favorite of the four main damage stats in the Souls games. Probably Faith. In half of them. Lightning is pretty cool. And then strength, because I like hammers. Wait, Cooper the Raid? Cooper, what's going on, man? How are things? Hope stuff has been well. What did you guys get up to? We're out here doing a curved greatsword marathon across all the Souls games. And every time that we die, we have to do 10 push-ups. We're, we've been doing a bunch of like Souls marathons recently, just playing through all the games with like different weapons and like making videos, ranking all of like the weapon types. Um, but now we're playing with curved great swords. I was like, you know, might as well make these runs more interesting. 
And now we're doing some push-ups because I sit down in this chair way too much. How many push-ups am I on? Well, it's 200 for the entire marathon. I died like 15 times in Dark Souls 1. Yeah, Dark Souls 1. To crush that rusty guy on YouTube? <laughs> rusty is fine. He's okay. Can I not die, please? See you, Najika. Save this gameplay for the video. <laughs> Five. <laughs> He's like, he, he does okay. He's entertaining. I'll give him that. I'm um, Articul, it's gonna man, how are things? Fitness champion Yui Ark? Yes. I just dislike his tier lists, yeah. His opinions could be very interesting sometimes. Where is my Seldora set? People have been saying to use the um, Alvar armor because, you know, we're using curved greatswords, and it looks pretty cool. And so what did you get up to today, Coop? How are things? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Been playing anything new recently? How's, like, the drought of content coming along? Because, you know, at this moment, we're just, like, waiting for the DLC, and we're just doing a bunch of other stuff in the meantime. Ah, Ribbit, what's going on? How are things? Hope you're doing well. Um, cool. Why am I here again? I don't know. I just came here to go get the gold pirates in the trio. I just ran through. Um, let's go to kill Covetous Demon. Been loving the ranking videos, by the way. Nice. We found, like, a new niche for content for the... for the YouTube channel. It's been pretty cool. <laughs> it keeps you healthy and ready to not die before the DLC. That is true. I did not want to die before the DLC comes out. That would be very tragic. Is that a show? Outside of fall, yeah, we've died to full damage. We've fallen off a cliff. What, we've died five times this run? And four of them have been falling off a cliff. That's pretty cool. <laughs> pretty good numbers. Seek, seek lust. Mm -hmm. I can get this to plus seven. We'll go kill the Smelter Demon. Actually, no, we'll go kill the old Demon, old Iron King. And then we'll go get the Arc Sword. That's gonna be the strat. Because at that point, I can go get some Petrified Dragon Bones in the DLC. Oh, I'm gonna have to do a Suicide Run. Oh, I have to do more push ups. Fuck. That's fine. I need to do a Suicide Run to get the key to the DLC. Why do all the DLCs have the petrified dragon bones for? That's so annoying. You're gonna be swell? Yeah. Speaking of swell. What's going on, girl? Actually, I don't need to talk to her. It's fine. There are like a couple chunks here. We can go acquire those. Actually, I wanna kill this guy because he does a lot of damage to me that attack, and I don't want to deal with that attack right now, I'm not going to lie. Titanite Chunk. Is there a chunk here too? Cool. No, bad skeleton. No poison, please. What sword do you want now? We have the Murakuma on right now. We're gonna go switch to the Arc Sword in a little bit. Bro, shielded enemies in this game are actually broken. We're gonna switch to the Arc Sword after the old Iron King, and then... 
we gotta use that for like most of the playthrough because the next one we can get is in the DLCs. No dying. See you, boob lady. The green apple vape level? What does that mean? Got a shield break? Yeah, I know. You think I would? But like, the animation is like just longer than kicking, so like, I never bothered doing it. I should have just left the kick in the game. Okay, chat, so what are your thoughts on top 10 early game weapons in Elden Ring? What are your thoughts on that video? You think that'd be a good idea? Yay or nay? There's like nothing else that I can really plan on. Cause I gotta do that, we'll make this ranking video for this thingy. I gotta go rank all the unique skills. Um, I gotta do that. But that'll probably end up being like... In a little bit. I do wanna play... Stellar Blade. I'm not sure if I make my ranking video before Stellar Blade. When does Stellar Blade come out? Two weeks? I might make my video before then. We gotta go play with more unique skills in Elden Ring. There's a few that I haven't played with yet. He's built just like me for real. This is so much more damage. Than the curved greatswords. Or the curved scythes, I mean. <laughs> That's Yui before the push ups, yeah. Isn't this chick on TikTok? Wait. <laughs> I needed this vid yesterday. Uh, what vid? The early game weapons? Whole lot of cake. Wish the covetous demon had feet. What's the requirements for some of these things? The Arc Sword is 26 strength. Wow, that's really cool. The Curved Dragon Sword is 30. Wait, the Curved Neil Sword is a strength-based weapon. It has the highest dexterity requirement out of all the Curved Great Swords, and it's a strength weapon. Why does the game hate me? <laughs> this makes no sense. A mace ranking would be interesting. There's like a lot of hammers though. Like I don't want to do weapons that have like a lot. Otherwise it'll be like over a hundred things to rank. That's why I want to do this. The curved greatswords because there's not that many. Um, Vigor it sounds pretty healthy. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> We're going to be responsible this run. I do not want to die. Top 300 things you missed in the DLC trailer. <laughs> Welcome back to today's video, guys. Top 300 things you missed in the Dark Souls 3... When I dodge 3. Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth Tree trailer. Earthen Peak! My favorite area! Oh no! This is fine. Gotta start the vid like Rage Gaming. What's like Rage Gaming's intro? I must copy their ideas. Okay, we're actually gonna have to kill these guys because... This area is dangerous. We're gonna try the first time and then just sprint past it. Ah, uh, Black Pot 69. Nice. Thank you for the follow. Make the thumbnail with your mouth wide open, then circles and arrows. Sounds like a very solid strategy. Okay, now we could actually one hand the weapon. Let's actually do that. Cool. It's 
very fast. The follow-up swing is nice. That's really nice. I like that. I can get behind this. I can get behind this. It's a lot less stamina too. I'm nervous for Elder Scrolls 6 after Starfield. Um, you should be nervous about everything Bethesda related. Respectfully. Let's light up the windmill. Huge. And they're dying two swings, so we'll just go. Mannequins deserve the most painful death of all time. These guys suck. How are these attacks missing? How? <laughs> Went over their head. Is it just me or is Yui kind of swole? I'm obviously swole. I'm huge, look at me. It's gonna be a Skyrim with unreleased mods. Probably. I haven't played Skyrim, but I'll probably play Elder Scrolls 6. Because it's gonna be a new game, and I do not want to die here. Run away! Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. No, no, no! We can win this still? Mannequin Saber is the best weapon in Dark Souls 2 facts. What are these factual statements based off? Oh! Get to the stupid fog wall. Don't hit me. E. Z. Game. Okay, let's just heal up. Oh, I don't like Mytho. I'm not a Mytho fan. I would like a tail cut there. I'm not a Mytha fan. Do you like the lunging attack so I can heal? Thank you. I want the tail cut. Haha. -ha. No tail swipe for you. No grab attack for you. That hit me? Do the lunge. <gasps> I've been hit. Do the lunge. Come on, girl. She's literally one shot. I don't want to choke this. We didn't choke. I played it really carefully. I don't. <laughs> I'm really trying not to do push ups. I'm not gonna lie. I'm like anti workout right now. But if it happens, it happens. I can just tell because later in the playthrough, I'm gonna die a whole bunch. I'm gonna have to do a bunch of push-ups. And I'm trying to like recuperate because my shoulders are not being very kind to me right now. Or if I were built different. I'm anti-workout all the time. First time I've tried in a long time, yeah. Did I save that gameplay? I wasn't paying attention. Now I did. Oh god, the Iron Keep. This is gonna be fine. 100 more push-ups are coming now. And I gotta clear this area as well because I gotta get the Petrified Dragon Bones. And I gotta go make that jump to get the Petrified Dragon Bone. Um, that's fine. That's okay. This is a non-issue. Lightning buff the entire time, that's a good strategy, yeah. 21 Gold Pine Resin. We can go get some more later. Um, I would like that, and I would like Endurance. 
just die, you'll be a muscular monster. I didn't think so. But for my body type, I don't think it works that way. I'm just like always skinny. Doesn't matter how much that I eat. Because I eat a lot. I mean, I'll probably work out a lot and... I'm still skinny. I'll just get more definition than what I already have, so... That's all it is. The playthrough has been somewhat smooth. We need health. 34 life gems. That's good enough. I think I picked up another... Estus flask shot? Did I? Where did I pick one up from? I feel like I did. I did. Fishman has returned. I finally have both of my mods in my chat. I picked up two? Where did I get these from? <laughs> I forget where I get these from. Makes no geographical sense. It doesn't have to make sense. It's fine. Like, I don't have to... <sighs> I don't have to clear out this area right now. Baby back. Like the Justin Timberlake song. That's sexy back. <laughs> Baby back. I'm a fucking idiot. Stupid fucking dum dum. One thing that I appreciate about this game is that the running attack into light attack combos are actually really good. I can get behind it. It could be worse. I could be going through this area in New Game Plus. It could be worse. I'm a red Dennis. Okay, that did a bit too much damage for my liking. Tactical retreat. Heal up. Aha, now you're trapped, buddy. Damn, he has a lot of health. Did you see my comments? What was your comment? Can you not soul vortex me, please? Backstab. I have no stamina. Let's go one hand this bad boy. Get him out of here. Bonfire aesthetic only run when? No. Luella, what's going on? How things? Said maybe you can tier list the covenants from the Souls games? A covenant tier list sounds interesting. If there was Elden and Covenants, I probably wouldn't do it. Um, what am I doing? I forget. It two shots them and it unlocks them. That's good enough for me. It's good enough for me. We're gonna have to be careful and methodically make my way through this area. He sells charcoal pine resin, doesn't he? Yeah. Favorite covenants? The rat covenant. Hell yeah. It's just so cool. Anything but the dark lurker covenant. Yeah, and poison is really good, so yeah. <laughs> Okay, just one at a time, and I'd like it if I did not die. That hurt. I'm gonna have to make that jump chat. That scares me.
We like both knocked each other back far enough to where I couldn't hit him. Um, this is fine. Let's go lower the level. <laughs> I almost fell off the ledge. Okay, it's just a simple jump. It's just a simple jump. It's just a simple jump. It's a simple jump. Why did it baby jump? Why did you baby jump, you stupid idiot? Why? Why did it baby jump? <sighs> Who adds RNG jumping? This sucks, dude. Okay, 10 push ups, it's fine. Not even a big deal. It's just 10. That's fine. Can I not die again, please? Updated 210 now. That was nine? That was not nine. I counted, I'm good at counting, trust. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're just gonna run. Fuck everything else, we just run. We tried the first time. And I ain't trying to fight Sharon, she's a bitch. Mistakes are made. If I didn't get hit by that arrow, I would've been fine. Why? I was about to jump, and I was a, I was scared to get staggered as I was about to jump from the other guy because I thought he was about to swing, so I turned back around to go do a double. Oh, <sighs> this is so shit, man. Why do I get hit by every single arrow in this game? Oh, I hate everything. I hate everything. It was such- oh, why couldn't you just jump the first time? I don't know why- it, it just always fails. This guy. Never misses. See why- look how much further it jumped that time compared to the other time. Did you see that shit? Oh, they have RNG jumping in this game. Stinks. Sometimes you jump far, and sometimes you just don't jump far enough. It's like, why? Back down we go. Oh, please stop. Why can't they chase me down here instead? So I can fight them here. Oh my goodness me. It's fine, it's still one just. Okay. You gotta come this way. Oh, it aggroed the guy with the arrow too. Because why wouldn't it? Okay, we're just gonna go fight this boss.
This is fine. I'm just gonna one hand this bad boy. That's a really quick combo. I'm gonna do 10 more push-ups, true, fuck. Um, fuck. Concentrate on this boss fight first. This is so fun. It doesn't consume much stamina, which is really nice. I can appreciate this. I can appreciate this. Oof! I would like to not die, please. Stamina region, can you be a bit faster? Do you even have the plus one chlorine thing on? I don't. I'm scared to like strafe that attack. Cool, first try, easy game. Go. Cool. <clears throat> nice. Um, that's fine. That's okay. That's not a big deal. Smelter Demon is cool, I agree. Okay, what we gotta do is we gotta go back. And level up. And do 10 more push ups. Fuck. What's that, 220? <laughs> We've died seven times already today. Yeah, we'll get the Ring of Blades, yeah. We'll get the Ring of Blades. <sighs> okay, 25 of that. Um, endurance. Strength, Endurance. Actually, I had a Strength afterwards. Go Endurance. I hope they bring back Mimics in the DLC. They should, right? Surely. Um, let's go buy these. Arms are gonna feel like spaghetti. We'll be okay. I'll manage. If anything, my back is hurting me more. <laughs> There's a sign that I haven't worked out in a while. I need a massage. That'd be nice. Chad, he's good at giving massages. Okay, I've got to get the other petrified dragon bone that's in this. <laughs> Do I risk it? I want to get the other petrified dragon bone. <sighs> Let's go buff. Bonfire is that it can kill Rodden 10 times over every other strategy. Oh, why is adaptability such an important stat? It's like, it's a, I'd rather go into damage, but like... There be times like this, you get hit by some attacks and it's like, oh, I don't have to level up other stats. I want to level up my damage and requirements for other things and... My stamina and stuff like that. The shit that makes the game more fun. All the stuff that makes the game less frustrating.
One attack at a time, basically. I can get two off here. Oh, nice dagger. Huge. Huge dagger. We actually picked up the Ring of Blades this time. I didn't actually just run back. Cool. Nice. Huge. Okay. Is there a guy directly on this side of me? Yeah, there is. Um... Turn the level? This is fine. Okay, petrified dragon burn. Good. That's all we needed. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Let's leave. Let's leave. Oh, I'm gonna have to do the skips to go down to the broom tower. Oh my god, that's gonna be even more deaths. Oh no. Oh no. Did I pick up another chunk? Can I get this a plus eight? Where's my chunks? I did! Nice, I can get this a plus eight. I'm gonna switch to the Arc Sword and this is gonna be doing more damage because I'm not gonna have enough Petrified Dragon Bones to get to plus four. Which is kind of the equivalent, right? Somewhat. Somewhat! If Dark Souls are so good, why didn't they make a Dark Souls 2? That is true. Would you like for them to make a Dark Souls 2 chat? Or no? Do you think it needs one? Um, Vitality again. I think this other weapon's more heavy. Needs some more Vitality. The Arc Sword is nice. <sighs> Iron Keep Part 2. It just be milking it? Yeah, true. Don't make another sequel. Don't. I don't like this place. That R1 combo is nice. I like it. I was gonna leave it one handed. And still two shots to these guys, that's really good. That's really good stuff. I wasn't expecting all of you guys to get aggroed. And I got hit by an arrow. That ruined everything. Get up! Dodge! This is good. This is good. I have to try so hard in this game. I don't like trying hard. Do I enjoy Dark Souls 2? Um, sometimes, yeah. Don't ask me when I'm doing Iron Keep, though. <laughs> Don't ask me right now. Af ask me after the Iron Keep is finished. Go watch an episode of Fallout. 
Shaking my head. What do I pay my moderators for? Honestly. A black steel katana. What's the running attack like? That is the stupidest recovery frames of all time. You we over TV, yeah, true. Once I'm done with the show, I'll be back full time. That's what they all say. Maybe I just need a new mod. Maybe I just need to look elsewhere. Maybe I need to get the fuck up and stop being bad at the game and actually dodge correctly. No! No! Chat, I'm so scared. That was close. I choked like two dodges in a row and I thought my entire life was over. Don't walk into that. <laughs> okay, let's go play it safe. Let's go up. Proud to see you getting jacked. I'm trying my best to not. Honestly. I just walk around. Um. They paid in being scorned by Yui. Pretty cool, yeah. Pretty cool. It's fine, Fishman. You can go watch your show. It's fine. Ugh. Clearly, you just like that show more than me. Why don't you just go marry the show then? If you like it so much. At least Ribbit is here. At least we have Ribbit. Everything is fine. Can I not? This guy is so stupid. I don't like you. You're a stupid. You're a stupid enemy. Just stupid. Stupid enemy. If he likes you more, he'll marry you. Isn't that how it works? Mod Satan Massacus confirmed. Maybe. Maybe I need some more mods. Maybe for Twitch as well. My all of my Twitch mods just always leave. Can I marry your nose? Then we can call it even. Fallout has a one good game mid franchise. <laughs> Is that true? Is there only one good Fallout game? I'll stay. It's okay. No, go watch your show. It's fine. Clearly, we know where your priorities lie. You do this all the time. <laughs> oh my god. You never want to be with me. It's always with that stupid show. Dodge. You're doing a second attack? Wow, look at him mixing things up. He's not like the other girls, he's way different. Look at him doing different attacks, wow. Look at him. resin wore off. How did this happen? Dodge. I'm Ikiyumi. Thank you for the follow. How did I get hit there? We didn't die. 
insane moveset basically is like area. Two attacks in a row. Clingy? I'm not clingy. I just require attention at all times. Light the bonfire. I forgot to pick up the stupid key to get to the DLC. Why does it need a key to get to the DLC? Stupid. Even though you're one-handing the whole time? The one-handed moveset is faster. It's faster. Look, look, look. Look at that one-handed moveset. Look at that. Now look at the two-handed moveset. A lot more stamina as well. Did you see that? A lot more stamina as well. <sighs> okay. Um, strength, dex, dex, strength, strengthy dex, vitality. Um, Push-ups? Did I did I die? I didn't die. I didn't die. No push-ups. No. I... I'll give you that one. Oh, I'm glad that I have your permission, Ribbit. Where would I be without you, honestly? I'd be so lost. Go purchase the life gems. Thank you. Okay, now I'm gonna have to go grab this key and hopefully not die. I'm gonna have to like run, pick it up, and... I don't know. Normally I do this as a suicide run. This is like really bad. Favorite Dark Souls 3 weapon? I like the, what do you call it? The demon skull. Really fun. Okay, video game. Um, I think I could just, do I put on the cat ring here? I don't know. Okay, video game. Why don't you use your stream clips for my videos? I do. I use the stream clips for my ranking videos when I do the Soulsborne rankings. Should I try and kill these guys? Stop! 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 No, he's literally one shot! Kill him! Okay, what I'm gonna do... I don't think the other guy can hear me, right? Put this on. Pick this up. And vacate. I didn't need to kill the other guy. We're so good. Everything's fine. I was just worried if they're, they're both gonna hit me from both sides, you know what I'm saying? Oh, God. If the other weapons are slower two-handed, a lot of weapons are slower two-handed. Ribbit, best girl? True. Vought Hammer is my favorite. Vought Hammer is really cool. A lot of the Great Hammers in Dark Souls 3 are really viable. A lot of them just tend to be like the exact same thing. Some are just outclassed by others, but... For the most part. I can put on the helmet! Nice! I still like naked from the waist down, but that's fine. The chicks love that. Okay, we have the key. I think the salamanders in this game are cute. True! The salamanders do have feet. The Yankees won? Nice. I don't watch baseball. Not my thing, too boring. Even though I played it for like 10 years, but... Playing it wasn't too bad. I don't like watching it though. Did someone say feet? We summoned him. We summoned the feet man. Mm -mm. 
But yeah, I use my stream clips in my videos, but I record the actual clips while I'm doing it. I don't actually have my... the actual stream clip, so to speak. I just, like, click a record button and it records, like, the last 10 minutes. Basically. Just an asparagus is my quirk. I can't decide between Yui's Greek god of a face or my Fallout TV show. I don't have a Greek god face. The Fates tier list will come after the ladder tier list. I've already done a Fates tier list. I haven't done a ladder tier list though. I think an elevator tier list comes before one. I like your face. Thank you, Ribbit. I like yours too. The Fallout show is out already? I think so, yeah. Well, Fishman has been watching it and he's been enjoying it. I cannot believe that they straight up copied this from Elden Ring. This is why Dark Souls 2 would never be the best Souls game. All it does is steal other people's ideas. Are you saying you do now Mew or look Max? That's not even fucking words. What does that even mean? Fume Knight or Alone in terms of difficulty? I think so Alone is harder than Fume Knight. Imo. I struggle more with the Sir Alone. He just gives you like less openings. Fume Knight gives you more openings. That's what it seems like. Or like the openings that Fume Knight gives you last longer. So you can actually use like larger weapons and heal more often. Whereas like Sir Alone, he gives you like such small amounts of openings. Or well, like the openings don't last very long, so you can only like use viably like quicker weapons and you can't even heal sometimes after an opening. Like it's that, that short. Um, that's my opinions on it. Ah, uh, Leo, what's going on man? Uh, I need to go get an arrow. I mean a bow. I just finished it today then I deleted the game right after. <laughs> nice. So I'm guessing you had a fantastic time playing the game. There's Soulsborne Rizzlers. What does that mean? The Rizzlers? Like the people who have maximum Riz? I don't know. Bow. I need bow. I must acquire a bow. Oh, you know what else I need to go acquire? Alluring Skulls. Oh, uh, doing this is like beyond cringe, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't want to equip it, I wanted to consume it. Oh no. Oh no. We might die a bunch here. Which is not good. Not good. Absolutely not good. Okay, three alluring skulls. Season 2 of the Fallout show was confirmed before the first season even came out. They do be doing that. Okay, so all we gotta do is just make our way down with great skill. Why didn't you wear a panth? Wear a fucking what, sorry? <laughs> Alluring skull! Go! That one room? It's fine, we can make our way down. Okay, please, no baby jump. Please, just jump normally. Please! Praise, praise the sun. And the lord. Nice. One jump completed. Hell yeah. <sighs> okay.
Do you know the fuck? Do you know what sucks as well? Like, I've died like five times by falling off a ledge. And they could have all been preventable if you could quit out while falling down, but you can't quit out of the game while falling down. Dark Souls 2 says no. Oh, okay, this is fine. I'm so scared. I'm gonna use a human effigy just in case I die to full damage. Okay. Okay. Please don't fuck this up. Please no baby jump. No! No 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 I spammed it. I spammed the button too. I should have been a bit further back. Get more of a running start. I had the perfect first try jump and everything, honestly. Look, we'll try this again. If I fail again, I'm not gonna do it anymore. I've never been so disheartened by missing a jump. I need to save my push-up stamina for, like, later game bosses, you know? <laughs> I need to save it. I can't be wasting my push-up stamina now. Please. Please. For all that is holy, please. Did you guys see the you died screen? I didn't. I didn't see a you died screen. I didn't see one. <laughs> this is so bad. I don't understand why I'm missing these jumps. It's I'm spamming the L3 button too. Please tell me it saved my progress. Which one is my character? I don't think I died. Did it save it? Nothing happened, chat. Nothing happened. You guys saw nothing. Okay, please. Please. Is it because I was falling off the side there? I think so. Just fucking do the jump. Stop being a bitch and just fucking do it. Just jump. First try. I just needed to spam it earlier. That's all it was. Okay, we can do the 10 right now. Oh, the, even the part after this is like mega cringe as well. Like, and I have to go... Oh. This is so fine. This is not a big deal. Because, like, the thing is, I don't need to get the Petrified Dragon Bones here. I can just get other ones. Um, but, like, these are the earliest ones I can get. And there's two curved greatswords that require Petrified Dragon Bones. And Petrified Dragon Bones can't be, like, infinitely bought until you beat the fucking game. <sighs> Were you grunting during the push-up? I was counting during the push-ups. Grunting. Oh, the fuck, I'm not allowed to count? <sighs> Can I count? Do I have fire bombs? Can I just hit the thing? That seems not safe. I'd like to get some fire bombs. Um, everything is so okay. 
230 push-ups already? Well, like 230 counting from my Dark Souls 1 run. So I did 15... I died 15 times in Dark Souls 1. Um, for Dark Souls 2, we've died 8 times. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, the Shrine of Amana is going to be an interesting place. Once it collapses on the floor, the run is over. Dark Souls 2 is harder than Dark Souls 1, concrete proof. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, YMB, what's going on, man? How are things? I don't know if Erin's work, it's fine. We've got, we've got fire bombs now. This part sucked as a caster. I can imagine how terrible it is as melee. Um, don't walk into it. That's not a very intelligent thing to do. Don't walk into it. Okay, walk the other way. Thank god the weapon didn't deflect off the wall, even though it just did. How is that thing still alive? I'm just here to get the petrified dragon bone and nothing else. Go that way. You're right in position. Nice. Fantastic. And I fucking missed. Stop strafing! I should lock on, that makes sense. <laughs> That's eight petrified dragon bones. How many does that get me now? In total. That's eleven. How many do I need to max out a weapon? I can't I forget what the like leveling up system works. How does it work? Um petrified dragon bones. How does it work? I think you need like 15 or some shit, right? But like, how does it like rank up? Is it like two, four, six or some shit? How does it work? Anybody know? There is one more petrified dragon bone up ahead. Or is there two? I think there's, is there one or two? Two can be found in a corpse. Okay, yeah, it's two up ahead. Okay, I would like to get the two up ahead. If I die, then I guess that's just a skill issue. I'm so scared. Can this thing just go away? Oh my god. No, I was too too late. Oh my god, I had no time there. Dodge. That wasn't even that bad. That was easy. That was easy. God. Liked your scythe video? Good work. Nice. Thank you, man. Glad you enjoyed the video. Okay, now I'm pretty sure the petrified dragon bones are here. No. No. No, absolutely not. Let me pick this up. Cool. Since I'm down here, might as well get the Scorching Iron Scepter. 
Oh, fuck. No, I sh that was a mistake. Now I'm gonna kill her. I- no, I haven't- there's a bunch of the base game I haven't done yet, no. <laughs> I just came to the DLC early to go get the petrified dragon bone. Can you wait a second, girl? Where is my fucking flame butterfly? Now we wait. She's not taking as much damage as I thought she would. I'm not gonna lie. Let's hit her. Oh, she gets poised. She gets poised. She gets poised. What if I hit him with a two-handed heavy attack? You gotta walk back into the fire. My opening! I don't like video games. I hate fighting NPCs with an absolute passion. With an absolute passion. I should have just homeward boned out. I didn't I didn't need to go. I'm not gonna clear this area anyway. I'm not What a mistake that was. What an absolute mistake that was. <sighs> Why am I like this chat? I should have just home- I forgot that she invades, I forgot- I mean, I didn't forget that she invades, but I forget invasion can't home and bone out, because normally I just like suicide when I'm down there. I should have just home and boned. Now I have to do 10 more. I wasn't sure if that was 10, so I did like an extra one. You know what? That wasn't the worst experience. I only died there twice and I got all the petrified dragon bones. That's, that's good enough. I've had way worse experiences going down there. Just do like a running attack with a bunch of two. Have I been saving some of this gameplay? I don't even know. So I'm gonna kill this one last boss. We'll go to Stride, Stride, whatever the fuck his name is. <sighs> um, go get the Arc Sword. That should level up a decent amount of times. I do have like I can farm the Petrified Dragon Bones and Aldia's Keep because I do have a uh bonfire aesthetic so when i go get the dragon sword i could just do that doesn't youtube save the vod um yes youtube does in fact save the vod why am i even doing this i never go kill these guys just run away just run away The Ruin Sentinels. Red Bull run when? No full damage. Ha! You missed, you suck. You suck. Gonna let me get a plunging tackle. Oh, I hate fighting these guys. They never let me get a plunging attack. I always miss. 
You can't redirect attacks in this game for nothing. Stop blocking! Nice. One-handed is very good. I like one-handed. One-handed movesets are poggers. Do people even say that anymore? Probably not. And I see that as an absolute victory. Okay. It's said ironically? Fair enough. Have you platted every Souls game? No, I don't really care to platinum the games. I haven't even platinumed Elden Ring, so... <laughs> platinum in the games, it interests me none. If I have platinumed the games, it's been by accident, so... <laughs> it's like, platinum in games is make them, like, less fun. It's, like, worse. Running attacks suck on, like, almost every single fucking attack. Every single weapon. Do you like that platinum sound effect and dopamine hit? I understand that. But the process of getting there is like... Was it really worth it? That gameplay must be saved. Dark Souls 3 Platinum is killing me? I actually did do the Dark Souls 3 Platinum. That's because I played a lot of PvP. I had like a thousand hours in Dark Souls 3 before I actually got the Platinum. <laughs> I think about a thousand hours, yeah. Somewhere close to that. Oh, for fuck's sakes, I forgot to pick up another Petrified Dragon, though. Not Petrified Dragon, a fucking Fragrant Branch. Oh. Where am I getting a fragrant branch from? I didn't think that through. I can get one in... Um, where can I get one? I can get one in Harvest Valley. I'm gonna buy one as well. I'd rather get the one in the Harvest Valley though. Because I have to spend like 10,000 souls. Achievements in general is pretty pointless, yeah. I mean, it just depends on what you like want to get out of a video game. I mean, playing video games themselves are pointless. <laughs> um, okay. Hmm. I think this bonfire. But if you don't get an achievement, how will you know that you've achieved something? Um, it's called having self-worth. Understanding what you're actually worth as a person. And recognizing that the things that you do mean more than a little achievement that's been told to you by somebody else. Very nice. <sighs> Hate getting these waves of sadness about Diego missing. Oh. I mean, you've had the kitty cat for a long time. It's been like your buddy. This, I'm sure there's times where you probably come back. Cats can go missing for a while and then they probably end up getting bored and coming back. But like the outside life wasn't all cracked up to what I thought it was going to be. Or maybe he's like, you know what? This is my time to leave the house and go make a name for myself. One of those two things. It could be one of those instances where you see like your child leave the house for the first time and 
go out and explore. And he might come back, who knows. Gonna become the next Elden Lord, yeah. <laughs> He's gonna come back with like the frenzied flame eyes. Um... No, no, I want, I want strength. 40, 24 strength. Yes. Gotta be using the Elon Musk build. I know what type of build would he run, Ribbit? What's Diego's build? What was I doing? I do require 16 dexterity. Why did this have such high requirements? It's 26 strength. I am bad at math. Um, okay, let's go back to Stride. Strayed, whatever his name is. Um, the Salt Fort Bonfire. Strength for sure. He's a Chad character. Chad Diego. I haven't even met Diego and even I miss him now. Diego is the best. He'll be back. Upsetting his mummy like this. Naughty kitty. Does Radagon have lightning resist? No. I think it's just resist to like all the other elements. Obviously except for a holy. Captain America build in Dark Souls 2 was fun. Was it? Okay, um... I'm gonna trade in and acquire the sword and you're not gonna have it cost that much souls. You're a dick. Oh! I consumed the boss soul! What we're gonna do <laughs> is use cheat engine. <laughs> Only time we're using cheat engines to use the other weapons. Okay, it's fine. Flex L Sentry. Classic UE moment. Yeah. Cheating is based. Yeah. <laughs> Roads make me feel slightly better. You're welcome. That's why I'm here. Mm -mm. Open helpers. It's called the Flexile Sentry Soul, I'm assuming. Um, just drop anything random. Leave that. Discard that's not discard. Flexile Sentry Soul. Nothing happened, chat. Everything is perfectly fine. Trade item. There we go. <laughs> The Arc Sword. I mean, there's like no point in going the Arc Sword when the, like the Warped Sword is like so good. It gets like 130 counter damage. It's like really good. But bonfire aesthetics exist, so that's perfectly okay. Arc Sword time. Hell yeah! Look at that. That looks nice. That looks very nice. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. I think the Mirakoma gets a bit more range, maybe? Oh, no, it's very similar. Probably the same. Um, that's okay. Let's go level this bad boy up. Cheating is based, just ask my girlfriend. <laughs> Hope you guys have a very fulfilling relationship. Hope it works out. Smelter Demon, how will this affect Yui's legacy? I mean, my legacy is just basically known as the cheater. The guy who ranks things and cheats when plays the games. But I'd like to be remembered as a person that 
really gave it his best, and wasn't just some random big-nosed man. Do you have Insta? No. And if I did, nobody's checking it anyway. Plus four. I need two more Petrified Dragon Bones to get to plus five. That's good, though. I'm going for dying to Pinwheel. Never. Never died to Pinwheel. But yeah, that's probably my legacy and probably having a big nose, I guess. <sighs> Got to MySpace? Yeah. Follow me on MySpace and my Hotmail account, I guess. What was it called? MSN. <laughs> MSN. Hell yeah. What do you kids know about that? Okay, what the fuck am I doing now? I need strength. Ribbit with the $9.99? $10 from Ribbit? Absolute chad behavior. W's and chad for Ribbit. I'm sure the a alert will pop up soon. I need 26 strength. Thank you, Ribbit. That's very, very kind of you. W, Ribbit, you're awesome. <laughs> True. Doesn't get much better. When are we gonna get a penis reveal? A penis reveal? You guys didn't see it already? Thanks. You guys haven't subscribed to my OnlyFans? And you guys call yourself real Yui fans. Disgusting. I need to go fi figure out um, how I can make the YouTube alerts pop up in a timely fashion. Because they're always like 10 minutes delayed and I don't know why. I'm broke. Feet finder link? What the fuck is feet finder? <sighs> okay, now we have the thing. It's just the same moveset, right? I'm not tripping. Yeah, it's the same moveset. I don't like that heavy attack. But it's like a downward swipe though, which is cool. If we're in tight corridors, that could be nice. There it is! There's the super chat. <laughs> Thank you again, Ribbit. For the $10 reduce. That's like a thousand Australian dollars when you really think about it. You're basically paying for my everything. Any plans for a cosplay stream, like a 100k sub milestone? What? No, I don't have plans for that. Who should I cosplay as anyway? <laughs> what do you guys want to see? Um, should we go to Seldora? Wait, where's some other petrified dragon bones? I'm trying to think. Where do I acquire more? What's like on the way? I don't think there's anything else like on the way, right? Oh, there's another one in the Black Gulch. I can go to the Black Gulch. Oh, there's one right next to Strayed. In the cell. I forget about that. And there's a couple in Cell Dora. And there's also one in the Doors of Pharos. Oh, we're so good. Okay, first things first. I forgot about that one. Is it Strayed or Stride? I don't know how to say his name. Patches? Should I go bold, chat? Should I shave my head and go bold? Fishman with a one dollar. W is for fishman. <laughs> Mr. Money Bags, yeah. Okay, let's go to the Black Gulch. Get the petrified dragon bone here, and then we'll go kill a rodden and hopefully not die in the process. W for the YouTube alert, yeah. Thanks I, I didn't figure out how to make it not be so delayed. TTS. I'm not lowering the price of TTS. That's not happening. There are some petrified dragon bones in the dragon sanctum. So I do benefit of getting the forgotten key. I'd have, like, the Berserk music over that. Hopefully, like, YouTube doesn't, like, demonetize the stream. Hey, look, you have anime music playing. 
not allowed. How much money does it need for a nose reduction surgery? I think I looked it up, like a nose job is like about like 10, 15 grand. <laughs> it's pretty expensive. Depending on like where you go, I guess. You could probably go to somewhere like Turkey or some shit. Where everyone has big noses and probably get it pretty cheap. But yeah. We don't hear any music? You guys don't hear the music? Okay. Let's go gold pine resin buff this bad boy up. Oh yeah, big damage. I can't see anything. Back alley nose job, yeah. I hate these guys' hitboxes. They're like so bad. It's fine. I was fine taking damage there because I know that just knock you back. It's not like I can get stun locked. Dark Souls doesn't have a single bad hitbox. These guys have like the... One of the worst hitboxes. It's just because they have like an AoE when they do that downward slam. Like all their downward slams. And it just hits behind you. Super annoying. Um, now I know there's a petrified dragon bone. Right here I believe. W mods, yes. W mods. Paying me back the money that I... Uh, that I give you guys as wages, clearly. I could have took the elevator up and then just ran that way. That probably would have been the more intelligent option instead of using a homeward bone. That's okay. Let's go kill the rotten. The Voldemort node search. They need to be looking like Voldemort. It's full on. My favorite guy. Girl, I mean. I think it's a girl. Oh, that was close. Almost got for the almost got the backstab. Almost got the backstab. Jack the song Fiend? Fiend. What song is that off again? What it sounds familiar. Are you paying a ribbit more? No. I pay all my mods the same amount. 25 cents an hour. Nose delete for aerodynamic purposes. Travis Scott. Um, Fiend. Probably not. Not giving you iframes through a fog gate is a good mechanic, Imo. Why is why do you say that's a good mechanic? I'm just curious. Because the way I see it is that the more you restrict the player and the less freedoms that you give the player, the worse. You get iframes a half, one and a half seconds in here. Cut off his hands. I'm missing all of my attacks and I suck at this video game. I'm being sarcastic? Okay, cool. You never know nowadays, some Dark Souls 2 fans will have some pretty interesting takes. Okay, can I not die here, please? So this is basically the exact same thing that I've been using, but just like more damage. Everything's the same. It'll get more interesting once I end up getting... <sighs> um... Did I switch to my thing? I forgot to switch. When did I get in the dragon? Curved greatsword? Then things will get more interesting. 
keen infused nose. This is going smoother than the Dark Souls 1 run? Eh, uh, we're not even halfway yet, so. And we have to go to the last DLC to get one of the curved swords. If it just worked the same way as all the other curved swords, I wouldn't bother getting it, but it has like a cool heavy attack, so. <laughs> I want to get it. Okay. Yeah, the gravity deaths. I mean, the gravity deaths would have been preventable if I could quit out of the game, but it doesn't allow you to when you're falling down. Quite unfortunate. This thing has less durability. Not the same. It's the same durability. It's saying that goes higher. Um, oh, anyway, I can get this a plus five. I forget. That's the reason why I actually used the homeward bone. True. <laughs> True. Cool. Now I have zero petrified dragon bones. Now we're going to start again. And get 15 more for the other weapon. Isn't that really cool? Dexterity time. Time to go to the doors of Pharos. Get some more life gems. I died to gravity more times than anything in all the games. I'm pretty sure everyone always dies to gravity. The most. It's the hardest boss in the entire Soul series. Fucking gravity. Um, where is the doors of Phados? Let's go through, go pick myself up another petrified dragon bone and <laughs> Clifford. <laughs> nice. I don't want to have to kill the dog as well. Probably not going to bother. Like, the toxic is just going to fuck me up, I can tell. So probably just go get it and fuck off, honestly. Rank the Soulsborn pits. What do you mean by pits? I must know. The Soulsborn pits. To what are you referring to? This game is so much more enjoyable when you have poise. That's confirmed. <laughs> Having poise is huge. Um, is this the petrified dragon bone? This is a trap's chest, right? That is the petrified dragon bone. Nice. Would you look at that? Really cool. Pits that you fall into. Okay, cool. Which had poison Dark Souls 3? It would be nice, but it's not really that necessary. Because your movement is pretty good either way. And your attacks are pretty fast, so you don't really need. And you have hyper armor, so like that's like the biggest thing. It's like getting staggered while you swing, not really getting staggered before you swing. So I think it's fine. It works. Although having regular poise would be good as well. But basically poise and Dark Souls 3 is just hyper armor, which is like the most important thing. Did you hear the tragedy happened in your country? The tragedy happened in my country. What the fuck are you talking about? Um... Let's go back and just go run through. I'm not killing this boss. In Sydney. Sydney's not a country, but continue. Oh, the mall stabbings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I heard about that, yeah. <laughs> Pretty weird stuff. I'm surprised you guys heard about that. Normally that's like not... I wasn't expecting that to be international news. Mm -mm, 
The armpits too, yeah. Yeah, it happened in um Bondi, which is like an hour away from me. It's like in the city. Up north. Now there's some like crazy guy going around just stabbing a bunch of people. Apparently like even some like kids as well. I don't know, something stupid. Something crazy. And then he got shot and killed. Don't really know what the motivation was, but... Clearly, some fucking psychopath. Okay. Um, let's go equip some more alluring skulls, because this area sucks pee pee hole. How are my arms feeling? They're actually not too bad. It's more of like my shoulders and my back sometimes, like after I finish doing a set. I've been invaded as a saw. This doesn't count, chat. This doesn't count. This is PvP. This is not intended. This is so unfair. Like, of all the places to invade me. Heavenly Thunder. That doesn't count, chat. That was Ribbit. <laughs> Ribbit, what the fuck? It's a second invade, yeah. I don't even know how to- how the fuck do you play offline? I don't know, there's no like, Bruh. offline option. How do you go offline? <laughs> I know, it makes it more entertaining. I'm surprised that I'm like, not banned, because I'm using Cheat Engine while being online. I guess Dark Souls 2 just doesn't give a fuck, like... <laughs> Who cares? Who cares? Just said Steam to offline, the main menu. On this, on Steam. Okay, that's why. I was trying to like figure out the menu, and it's like, it doesn't fucking work. <laughs> well, now we know. Ah. <sighs> Fucking ribbit with her katana build. Unbelievable. Like, at least let me, like, clear out the NPCs first. That'd have been nice. Or, like, the other enemies and have a 1v1 fight. Like, what's the point? What the fuck, ribbit? There's no way these attacks miss. I didn't talk about it in the video. The fact that sometimes the attacks just go over their head. With the way that it swings. Elite boss? It is an elite boss. Let's record that gameplay. Elite boss fight. Now there are a couple of petrified dragon bones here. Is there one down below? I don't think so. Roaring Halmid the Crypt Black Sword. What are we talking about here? We're talking about the best dark weapons or. Oh, yeah, good dark weapons and dark swords too. Yeah, those two. <laughs> those two are really good. The Velstat Hammer is pretty good as well. There's plenty of weapons that get good dark scalings as well, so. Use like anything random. Oh, please. Oh, come on. Hitting a crystal lizard is like the most toxic thing in this game, and nothing else is worse. I need to get back. Because I think that one had a petrified dragon bone. I might be wrong. How do I take back the credit I took for that invasion? Um, 
I don't know. You have to make it up to now, me know. Repent! Easy game, first try. I'm gonna take a shower? Thank god my viewers actually take showers, that's good. Have fun in your shower. Wait, you don't actually watch me while you're showering? Bowman Guthrie. That's just an NPC. Anybody's confused. <laughs> Showering based. <laughs> when he showers, put a turn on. Is there a petrified dragonborn here too? That's a slab. I love that noise, it's so good. I saw there's another petrified dragonborn. Don't forget the 5-in-1 shampoo. <laughs> no, let me climb. No spiders. Bad spiders. No! Spiders, why? Why? I, I didn't have enough- If I had one more alluring skull, I would have been fine. People left a Yu-Gi-Oh tournament recently due to the B.O. stench. It's disgusting. <laughs> I had no stamina for the stupid, stupid ladder. Because I did a follow-up heavy attack when he had iframes, so I couldn't do anything. I was spanking on the attack one-shotting him. And it didn't one-shot him. <laughs> I should have some for the light attack combo, because I flattened him to the ground and that kind of fucked me over. God diddly darn it. That's fine. <sighs> what a travesty. Let's go buy some more alluring skulls. I can go try and get the other petrified dragon, but I forget where it is. Is there like another titanite? I mean, uh, what's his name? A crystal lizard? I needed 10 more push ups. Fuck. My body has slightly recuperated since the last set, so that's fine. Where did you get this armor set? I mean, I got it via cheat engine. Um, I don't know where you get it normally. Use a torch. That would have been the more intelligent option, but the thing is, I gotta swing. I gotta... Actually, no, I don't. I think when I pull the level... Does that still hide the torch? I don't know. Are you using the Arc Sword over the Murakuma? I've used the Murakuma for the first part of the run, now I'm using the Arc Sword, and we're gonna go switch to the Dragon Sword once I get the ability to acquire that. Uh, Molan sells it, does he? Maybe he does. Okay, now whereabouts is this other petrified dragon bone? I feel like there's two in this location. Am I wrong? Near the chapel threshold bonfire. Out the door and right of the lo lower brightstone cave bonfire. I think that's like... Hmm... Hmm. Arc Sword is a pretty ass weapon. Wait, pretty... What do you mean? Does it mean like that it looks really good? Or like... It's ass. What do you mean? <laughs> now, by the description... It's telling me that it should be here. I think the game lied to me. <laughs> Adaptability over secular. <laughs> I don't know where it is. The other petrified dragon bone. Fuck. Go that way. Oh, the door stays opened? I thought I had to reopen the door. Hopefully adaptability comes back in the DLC. <laughs> That'll be really cool.
Um, fantastic. We do a little running. Does Catch Flame still fuck Radagon? Yeah, it does. Anything that basically does fire damage is gonna destroy Radagon. I'm gonna come back here as well, because I gotta go get the memory. Fuck. There's no bonfire down here. Ugh. Secutor comes as a boss. They just like put the entire Secutor in the DLC just like as a mini game. Okay, cool. Let's go kill the stupid spider. Wait, I don't use a life gem. I want to use a gold pine resin. Die. 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 My stamina back. I never know how to dodge that attack, I'm not gonna lie. We can win this fight. This is nice. I see that as an absolute victory. We won. But I gotta do 10 push ups, don't I? Fuck. Move spider. Are you still alive? Gets lit or gets cheeky? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Okay, so that's the third one. Um, oh, we haven't killed the lost sinner. True. Rom is one of the dumbest bosses in Soulsborne. I agree with Bloodborne's story is so mid. Maybe, I don't know anything about the story. Okay, let's go use a human effigy. Let's go save that fucking shitty ass gameplay too. Um, we'll go to dexterity. I think I need more damage at this point. Oh, we're like fat. Fuck. This thing is heavier. I didn't notice. Okay, don't need that no more. I would like to get some more gold pine resin, but this is fine. So the thing is, I can go access the third DLC in a bit. And I can go and try and grab the weapon for that area. Or from that area. Uh, what's it called again? The curved nail sword. But that requires a lot of strength. And it's like a strength based weapon. So do I like respec or do I just go use it later on? I wish it like... Hmm. Who knows? Anyway, first things first, let's go kill this boss. Let's do 10 push ups. Fuck. That's 10 more. Cool. 240. Guy wearing that femboy socks? The fuck is femboy socks? <laughs> ankle socks? Are femboy socks? You can't wear ankle socks?
Lost Sinner is a fantastic boss. I like the Lost Sinner. I think he's pretty cool. I agree. Or she. Whatever it is. I don't know. Um... I don't know about fantastic though, I think it's a pretty strong word. Has a different two-handed light attack combo than the other curve soldiers and it's faster. What is this? For this weapon? I don't think so, right? It's the same moveset. Let's talk about the um the curved Neil sword. Now it has a different light attack combo, and I think it's slower, I don't think it's faster, is it? People mock Dark Souls 2 bosses for being a guy with a sword, but the best bosses are guys with swords. I don't think anybody actually says that. I've heard more people say that people criticize the game based on that than actual people criticizing the game based on that. I've never heard that complaint. Ever. I've seen like a thousand memes on it. I've seen people say that exact thing, but I've never seen anyone say... Dark Souls 2 bosses are just guys with swords. And that sucks. Like, I've never... <laughs> I've never heard that. Ever. I feel like when people complain about Dark Souls 2, there's like a thousand other things before they talk about. You know, it might just be an observation. Like, it is just a bunch of guys with swords. But like, are they saying that's a bad thing? I don't know. <laughs> One of the most popular hate Dark Souls 2 vids was like, dudes in armor. Was it? Okay. I don't watch those videos. Well, that's just one person. I've never heard it, so... If that's just one person saying that, fucking... Still dumb. Like, of all the things to criticize Dark Souls 2 on, it's the design choices of the bosses. Like, large bosses fucking just suck anyway, like... Oh, please, just fucking stay still. Holy shit. Let me hit you. Aren't you ever leveled for this fight? Yeah. Not really over leveled, more like I mean, yeah, over leveled. Yeah. I mean, I did it later on, so I just saved this boss for last for some for some reason. Normally, I do it earlier. Normally, I do it earlier. I normally save Freya for last. Like I have a plus five weapon, which normally you'd probably have like a plus three weapon. Especially a boss weapon, but thankfully for the DLC in Broom Tower, you can get some pretty good shit. Doing a bare fist company of champions run myself, it's hell so far. That sounds terrible. I forgot to switch to the stupid covetous ring. It's gonna leave it on, honestly. <sighs> okay, he's gone. See you, buddy. Okay, now. We can go pay a trip to Drang Lake, I believe. And then at Drang Lake, we can go grab the frozen flower. Then go head to the DLC. And then probably die there a thousand times. Good strategy. But what's the requirements? Um, curved Neil Sword, 28 strength and 26 dexterity. It's an A scaling in strength and a C scaling in dex. And a plus 5 is an S scaling. I mean, I'm not going to use it right now because it requires... Oh, it requires Twinkling Titanite. I can get Twinkling Titanite. How many? How much do I have? I think you need 15, dude. Don't you? It's like the same thing. I haven't been getting Twinkling Titanite. I've been forgetting how to get Twinkling Titanite. Oh well. Okay, we might go early DLC. 
I have three. I can get a bunch of twinks from the first DLC. I can. Um... Yes. That's I can. Uh, okay. Which one is the latter one? It's there. Top 10 languages to riz up the fire people. <laughs> Top 10 languages to riz up the fire people? I don't know. Chat, what do you think is the most, like, attractive language? Demon Souls remake should have had DLC. Bluepoint wasn't gonna make it. They didn't know how to make it. They just know how to make it look pretty and that's about it. <laughs> Add some cool quality of life features. These two Estus Flask is terrible? Probably. Um... Now, do I go to the first DLC? It's enough arrows. I think I do. I wanna get some Twinkling Tide Knights. Actually, I can do it later. Yeah, I can do it later. Because there are a bunch of Twinks in the first DLC. So I was gonna Drang Lake. Most attractive language is sign language. You see those finger skills? That seems valid. Seems very valid. Um, it could be use the lore of the lens shadows and make the... L what? Would make sense that mo most bosses are weak to holy? What, in the DLC? Yeah. Maybe. I don't see them, like, they might be, like, weaker to the holy damage, but I don't see them being, like, incredibly weak to holy damage. I don't think there's gonna be, like, a best damage type for the DLC. Is I don't think. Um, the Estus being bad was great for PvP? Probably. Probably. Blade would probably be the best. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised with how, like, Blade actually performs in the base game. They're probably gonna make a bunch of bosses immune. In the DLC. I don't- I don't doubt that that would be a thing. I do not doubt it. Kill him! Easy game. I think the best things to probably take it to the DLC would be like Death and Death and Black Flame, because that's gonna work on like everything. But I, I definitely picture a lot of... A lot of bosses being immune to bleed. I'm surprised that, like, the base game has that many bosses that are, like, weaker to bleed, because... In the other Souls games... Like, everything is, like, immune to, like, a lot of status effects. Like, Elden Ring is, like, the first game where, like, everything is just weak to something. Like, status effect builds are actually, like, really viable. And actually, like, metal. That doesn't kill. That makes me sad. Because I don't want people just, like, plowing through the entire DLC, like, willy-nilly. Just way too easily.
That's my opinion. Maybe sleep and death flight will be buffed? I don't think so. I didn't see them like cha changing the way like some of the base game things work. I don't know. I don't know. Either way, it's probably gonna work perfectly fine. Can you open the fucking door? This thing takes forever to open. Also going to try the DLC at level 1? Um, but like your first playthrough or like... <laughs> I don't recommend doing that, your first playthrough, but... Another good thing, the one-handed moveset is like more horizontal compared to diagonal. It's like so much better. Most based Souls player ever. True. Man, that's gone unveiling. How are things, man? Every enemy immune to all damage except crossbow damage. <laughs> okay, cool. Down we go. We're looking fine. We haven't died that many times. We've died nine times this playthrough. And how many deaths have been to full damage? About six, right? That's pretty good. <laughs> Not that bad numbers. Not that bad. <laughs> Make an enemy that's only weak to lore of causality. Yeah, like you specifically need lore of causality. To get some good damage. That'd be hilarious. Like the best way to kill Mesmo. Lore of causality. It would like that alone would just make it go from the F tier to the D tier. Huge. That's not the frozen flower. This one's the frozen flower. Silly buffoon. But there's a petrified dragon bone here as well. True. Can go get that. <laughs> Tibia summons. Shit's so bad. The death sorceries are an absolute just joke. Absolute joke. Petrified dragon bone. Huge. I think that's the only one here. Maybe there's another one somewhere. You can roll forward to push the door open faster. Is that real? Doesn't rolling forward just cancel the animation? What? What do you mean? That's cheating. This is fine. Just don't hit me. That was close. That's why you level up your Vigor. That's fine. Anyway, you can die. I said you can die. That was gonna be a one. Like, when you're just doing so much damage, you just, like, fight every single fight just, like, so stupidly. It's like, oh, I'm gonna kill him anyway. I almost died there, like, three times. 
Ranker Core is pretty good. Absolutely not. That thing sucks beyond belief. Even Ancient Death Ranker, I'd never use that shit. Unless you're like at max level and then maybe. But even then I still wouldn't use it over like a lot of other projectiles. Those things, I just, I hate the death sorcery so much. They're so bad. Um, strength. I need 30 at one point. Not right now though. Not right now. We go to thing. Thoughts on hexes and dark souls too? They're pretty good. Pretty good. And they're fun as well. Although I don't like how like expensive they are in terms of spell slots. Uh, the attunement slots is pretty high and the requirements are pretty high as well. Not a fan of that. That stuff, like the fact that they're so expensive and not very friendly to use makes me like sorceries more in Dark Souls too. Ancient Death Rancor is OP in PvP? Maybe it is. Weak to FP. What? <laughs> you can press R1 to... Wait, and roll to cancel the animation and do a quick roll? It skips... The animation, really? I didn't know that. You're always underleveled on all these runs? I'm not that underleveled. I'm at level 102. That's like recommended for Drang Lake Castle, isn't it? And also recommended level for Drang Lake Castle. Hex build stack Dark Orb and spam Dark Orb. Yeah, that's, a bit, that's about it, yeah. So it gets about like halfway through the playthrough when you can get access to the chime that's up ahead. The Kythus chime, I believe it is. Then you can go use Resonance Soul, then a spam Resonance Soul, or Great Resonance Soul. Ha! I have poise, fuck you. Mannequins! Oh, it takes three hits. Huh? Video game? I mean, to be fair, I didn't dodge, so... <laughs> it's not the video game's fault. Level 300 is recommended, sure. That one, the Kythus Chime. Yeah. Oh, there's another Petrified Dragonbone here! That's right. Isn't it to this side? Please be this side. It's, it's the other side. God damn it. Oh, I have to use a gold pine resin here. It's too many dudes. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. This is like, why do you fucking miss? Why do you miss? <laughs> Just take an extra step forward. I always go the wrong way as well. Like, I knew it was to the left side. I was like, no, we'll go to the right side anyway. Why not? It's gotta be there on the right side. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm so stupid. <laughs> it's the easiest marathon that I've done. I don't know. Probably the sorcery marathon is pretty easy. And, like, trying to fight, like, more than, like, two enemies in this game is basically just a death sentence. Like, no, not allowed. Not allowed. I'm vicious. Thank you for the follow, man. So, like in Dark Souls Three, you can get a you can get away with like gank fights because you have like the abilities to like counteract the ganks pretty easily. Not in this game. With how much like stamina things cost? No. Oh 
my god. These guys are the worst. You need to stop attacking. This is fine. Everything is so okay. I sw I fucking dodged. Oh, I should just wait for the three hit combo to finish. I don't know why I was being impatient there. I just want to get the petrified dragon bone, you fucking pieces of shit. <sighs> I'm back again, baby shower is molten lava. Nice. The shower is molten lava. Well, that's cool. I'm not a molten lava fan. Elden Ring fist only. I get that question every day, and I'm gonna answer the exact same way. Never. <laughs> oh, what does I keep missing? <laughs> I keep missing. This makes no sense. It makes no sense. It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make sense. Chat, it does not make sense. I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't make fucking sense. Where is my swing actually going? It's supposed to two-shot them for starters. Why is it sometimes you're just doing less damage than other times? I don't understand. You're supposed to get hit when I swing and that actually hit you. Now I have to do 30 fucking push-ups. We have to 10,000 souls. I don't give a fuck about 10,000 souls. I have to do 30 push-ups. It's more detrimental to my health. I'm pretty beneficial, but still. I don't get it. I can't even beat two fucking mannequins. You can beat any boss that's incredibly hard, but you put two mannequins in one room, and that's harder than any boss fight ever. Did Curve Slots have a sweet spot mechanic? No. It's only for like pole arms. I should have just had it one-handed. It's like such a better moveset. It's just such a better moveset. Like two-handed curves on attacks are such dog shit. Like you're not hitting nothing with that. It's basically just a vertical swipe. It's just a vertical swipe that can just sometimes miss at point blank range. Cause it doesn't even hit straight in front of you. It hits like to the side of you. Like look at that shit. I don't know. <laughs> Begin the complaining arc. We die more than two times in a row. It's basically just complaining. It's my own fault. That should not have hit me. That's cheating. Okay, well the hammer guy's down. That's the worst one. I don't know how to send the other guy I broke from the other side when I went this way. Die. Die. See, why does he aggro? I have to do 30 push-ups now. It was looking fine. Everything was fine. And then I come to this location. And then everything just sucks. Okay, how much damage are you looking at? I can kill him. All that for one petrified dragon bone. Oh, what an absolute tragic mistake that was. Now, do I risk getting the Estus shot here? Don't do that. Okay, can you give me one second? I need a tactical retreat. <sighs> I 
This is fine. Okay. 30 push-ups. That's fine. Easy. Easy. That's fine. Oh my god! No more fucking no. die. Oh my god! No more dying. No more dying. Doing 30 was not good. We need to try harder. We need to try harder. It's getting too hot now. Okay. Strip stream? It's fine. <sighs> okay, how much is that? 270. <laughs> That's so fine. That's not even a big deal. Gonna be jacked. Hopefully tomorrow's Dark Souls 3 stream is not that bad. Demonetized? For what? Taking off my hoodie? Have you seen half the stuff that you see on Twitch? <laughs> See them chicks that paint themselves green? Think I'm gonna get demonetized? Pontiff gonna fuck me up? Hell no. Hell no. Save Bloodhound Fang for last? It's too good? No. I'm not worried about Elden Ring. I could use any curve great sword and have it be like a no death run. The hoodie strip was too sexual for this platform. What do you mean? Is there a bonfire aesthetic here? I could use this to farm Aldia's keep. It's a soul vessel. I thought it was a um, bonfire aesthetic. I was wrong. Oh, we have the Magmorum scale sword too. Yeah, true. True. Wait, what's the like list of Elden Ring? Elden Ring has the most curved great swords. There's like at least seven. Seven or eight, maybe. Nine! Fuck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, the Onyx's Lord's Greatsword. I forget about that piece of shit fucking thing. Oh, God. There's four that can be infused, and then five that cannot be. Hmm. That's interesting. You can get, like, most of these early on as well. I ah, not really. Most of the ones that can be infused, at least. <sighs> Omen Cleaver, yeah. Omen Cleaver is a curve greatsword. Omen Killer Cleaver is a great axe. They're two different weapons. Magwarm Scale Sword is actually really good, yeah. Good weapon. Um, okay. This is perfectly fine. At least we have a decent weapon. Gonna get a hundred deaths in Elden Ring? No. Ten max. Ten max. Which I can do a hundred push-ups in one day, that's not bad. Albeit I've done hundred- I've done hundred and twenty today. 
That's okay. I should have used like I don't know. Another pine resin that's not um gold as well. I fucking hate this guy's shield. Maybe let's go the heavy attacks, I guess. Might as go the heavy attacks. Oh, even the heavy attacks are deflecting off. Come on. I'm trying to like go hit in a straight down line. Cause like the horizontal swipes was getting deflected off the shield. Aha! Nice. Heavy attack. What are you aiming? I don't get it. This is more stamina. No, don't do that. That's cheating, you're not allowed to get a hyper armor there. Whoa, he's sprinting at me hard! Look at him go! Okay, that's fine. Does he get staggered with every hit? Oh, he has no poise. What a bum. What an absolute bum. Nice, nice, nice. Good fight. Is it unpopular to say I love this boss so much? No. I think it's a good boss fight. There's the bonfire aesthetic. It's there. That's right. Okay. The Shrine of Amana. Uh, let's set up. Is the Shamsir strong in Elden Ring? Yes, it is. Shamsir is really good. Okay. Dark Souls 2 is better than Demons and 1. You're allowed to like it better. That's fine. Mm -mm. If Yui was a boss, I'd beat him on my 69th try. Nice. Shamsher is mid, Bandit's Curve Sword is straight upgrade in literally every way. Shamsher is a faster light attack combo. It's quicker, it's more easy to- it's like a dagger move, it's like dagger speeds, honestly. Probably more noticeable how good it is in PvP than PvE, but... The fact that you get a faster light attack combo is... More than enough reason to use it. I think if you're two-handing, then I think Shamsher might just be a better option, honestly. Although I think Bandits is the better overall weapon, because when you're power stancing, it doesn't make a difference. And power stancing curve swords is the best way to use curve swords. Just a fact. Okay, let's go do the Shrine of Amana. Most of the boss fights in Dark Stone are just fun, but not too hard, yeah. Okay, let's go pop a human effigy. I want as much health as possible. I think I can beat him my 39th. No one's beating me in a boss fight. If I'm a boss, you guys are never beating me. I'm a broken ass build. Play with amazing skill. Gonna cheat engine myself more health. Okay, that was almost tragic. Okay. <laughs> Don't do anything stupid. I should have used the life gem instead. It's okay, the first part of this isn't the worst. <laughs> the weak spot would be the nose. 
Uh, it three shots them. It doesn't two shot them. That's not good. Does two handing two shot them? Well, one handing or two handing one shots those guys. That's cool. Kind of wanted to spec into more vitality. Alver armor is pretty good drip. Oh no. Oh yeah, we're good. Everything is fine. Okay, chat. I'm gonna try dual wielding. Yeah, I wanted power stance. But, like, I can't really power stance till, like, later on. Because, like, I need a lot of strength. I need a lot of strength to power stance. Is the power stance moveset even good? Probably not. <laughs> okay. We just run and kill things. That's all it is. Oh, it just leaves them at 1 HP when two-handed. That's fine. Can you not... Bro, he just ran past that straight away. Okay, cool. Beans, I like That's still... They aggro from like there? You, that I normally like doesn't aggro that far right away. Now. I love beans. <sighs> of course I missed. Backstab, please. Iframes. Thank you. That doesn't give you iframes, so it's fine. Hyper armor works. Okay. Stamina back, full health. Nice. Huge. Cool, we did it. We did it. Thank the Lord for a good weapon. Area is wonderful, yeah, it's fantastic. Try to move that similar to the Murakuma, yeah, it just like hits more horizontal. I think it's a bit slower with the curved nail sword. Oh, he's doing that shit. No, don't do that. Start again. Just don't do the attack. Okay. Don't fall off the ledge. We just run. Through waste deep water. This is fine. Just don't do any stupid projectiles. The semen of dung incoming. Cool. Okay, this boss can do a lot of damage, so... Let's be normal here. I mistimed it. I mistimed it. Go 
Gotta like jump over the cliff. I disagree with that one. See, like, I don't understand the AoE attacks. It doesn't make sense to me. Oh, come on. Why are you doing this? I don't know, it doesn't make sense. What am I, am I getting hit by the water? Is that what's doing so much damage? Oh. This has been not a good fight. We did it. We did it. We did it. We made it through the Shrine of Mana first try. No deaths. Hell yeah. That was clean. That was clean, and that is the wrong way. Opposite direction instead of towards its arms, less chance of being caught. Uh, didn't I dodge in the opposite direction? Unless you mean like right instead of left when he does it with his right hand? I don't know. Or his left hand, I mean? I don't know. I don't get it. Either way, he's killed. See, like, knocking him back is cool, but, like, no iframes. I mean, he gets iframed, which is not cool. Not cool. Oh my goodness. Okay, what we're gonna do is pop all of these boss souls. And then we can go spend these on some more vitality. We probably gotta go to the DLC as well. Kinda want a power stance though, but like, it's shit's so expensive. 20, I mean, what, I need what, 30 strength? I need 30 something strength to two hand, or to power stance, I mean. I just killed a fly by jump into the air and swatting it. Been playing too many video games. That's a. Very athletic play. But you sort of fly in the sky and it's like, you know what, I'm gonna jump in there and swat it from the... <laughs> Wait. What? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Good shit. Seaman Souls has no curved greatswords? No. There's curved swords and there's like some larger curved swords, but like there's no curved greatsword category, so... There's like the large sword of searching, which is like a regular curve sword, but just like has a slower moveset. That one could have been classified as a curved great sword. Maybe. <laughs> Kill the fly with a jumping attack. <laughs> okay, strength, uh, dexterity. Uh, I said I needed vitality. I'm just a liar. Okay, go on to vitality. Then dexterity. You know what I still haven't put points into? Fucking adaptability. Like an idiot. Okay, put that on and... I don't know what else. I still have no pants on. God damn it. That's fine. Let's just go to the DLC, I guess. Can I get some more gold pine resin, though? We'll go do that. Go get some gold pine resin. Uh, uh, husband saw it and said it was incredible. Nice. Top 10 ribbit plays of all time. <laughs> A reverse jumping attack? 
What's the best strength weapon in Dark Souls 2 in the beginning of the game? Probably like a hammer, like a craftsman hammer. The um, old knight hammer, I think you can farm that early on. Pretty good stuff. Um, cool. I would like some more gold pine resin. Farewell. Ten more good enough. I, mean, I couldn't pop this. The craftsman hammer is really good, yeah. Farewell. I'm running out of homemade bones. Um, do I like beans? Yeah, beans are cool, I guess. Tried power sensing rapiers and it misses more than it hits. Power sensing rapiers? What, in this game or in Elden Ring? Ranking every Soulsborne sprint when? <laughs> no. Shrine of the Mana, but just Death Blight Water? Death Blight Swamp? Surely we get one in the DLC. Hopefully. Um, um, where am I going again? Actually, I needed to go back there. True. <laughs> it's fine. We're going through the DLC. Ranking the suns, moons, and stars in every Soulsborne game when? No. I don't think I will. Actually, I know. Dark Souls 3, son. Best. Best, son. Then probably Bloodborne. Bloodborne Moon. To the Shrine of Winter. I don't like this place. <laughs> I don't like this DLC. Wait. Wait, whereabouts? Okay. I'm forgetting where exactly... I actually acquired the curved nail sword. Location video. Oh, it's there. Cool. Rani is so hot. Is that true? Oh, that means I gotta kill... Oh, I have to go kill Ava first. Oh, no! I have to kill a stupid cat. That's not good. I always come back later, but I want the weapon now. I want it now. Okay, we're two-shotting these guys. That's a good sign. I need to put on some alluring skulls. Diego. <laughs> Diego is not a... Where is Diego? We need Diego back. Has to kill a cat. Diego is... ...not the cat that we're gonna kill. Okay. Diego is having a fantastic time by himself. And he's just being a little stubborn right now. I'm sure he'll come back. Do a little bit of killing of these guys. Any suggestions on what I should make to eat? Um, you've had enough. Go to sleep. You're having bed for dinner.
Why do dogs exist? Thank God for counter damage in this game. Okay. Can I donate 50 pesos? You don't have to do anything. If when Diego returns, you just discipline him. Just scold him. Scold the bad boy. Tell him what he did wrong. Oh, I don't like you guys. You guys are cringe. Gonna give him a big hug and a smooch? That's fair. <laughs> That's fair. You know what? We're just gonna run through this area. Fuck this place. I was gonna try and, like, kill them, but... Clearly, they don't want to cooperate with me. That was so fucking close. No, just let me run through, please. Bro, these enemies are just... <laughs> like, chill the fuck out. Do <laughs> you be shocked enemies don't want to be killed? It's mind-boggling, honestly. Where did... Okay, I thought that was an enemy. Like, how did... <laughs> it's at the random dude. It's fine. Oh, this guy has more health. We're gonna kill him all, though. It's fine. We're gonna be responsible. We're doing well. The same dudes from the Duke's archives? Maybe. They've upgraded. Can I get a backstab on these guys? They get staggered in two hits, which is fine. I can respect that. I don't know how he's spamming that attack so much. The frozen needle. Heavy attack consumes a lot of durability. Clearly not when this guy uses it. <laughs> how does it affect the Duke's archives legacy? Get him out of here. Damn, that's a lot of damage. Holy shit. Del's delicious when you eat it in bed? Who's Del? Max out a build with cheats and eldering and some reason discus of light just starts to hit different. Discus of light is actually really good. It's like amazing damage and only like 3 FP. 3 FP! This shit's actually insane. Is he still alive? No, he's definitely- <laughs> He's definitely not alive. That is definitely not the movement of an alive person. Definitely not. Hard to say anything with D's nuts in your mouth? Who's D's? I don't know who D's is. He's trying to seduce me? It's working. It's working. I'm very easy to get, honestly. I've been lonely for way too long. Duke's Archives was honestly always shit. Not enough adaptability. <laughs> Yui needs a Firekeeper? Maybe. Who is Dell? I don't know who Dell is. Backstab! Oh, that's not a backstab. I love having poise. Oscar fell off. Oh 
More alluring skulls, my favorite. <sighs> okay, so this area sucks. I have to go kill the stupid Ava pet thingy first. Um, let's go do that. Let's go do that. Wait, do I do that? How I need no, I need twinkling tide knights, don't I? Toru, I need twinkling tide knights for this thingy. Toru. Ah, uh, Deadnails, I think for the 69 gift, uh, 69 bits. It doesn't actually work. <laughs> the um, alerts aren't popping up. Because you need to spend at least 100 bits for the alert to pop up. <laughs> Thank you for the 69 bits six times. Thank you, man. <laughs> w is for dead nasty. All the 69s. Nice. Okay, gold pine resin time. How much to bust it down oiled up? Um, what? I don't know how much money are you willing to give me. I got a price. Dead nasty, think of the 420 bits. <laughs> He's just like me for real. Okay. I'm just gonna R1 spam because I didn't go fuck if I get hit by this shit. I'm not a fan of this stupid dumb tiger. Not a fan. I don't like him, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I don't like him. There's no grab attack. Dead Nasty with the 1420 bits. Nice. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. My guy's feeling generous today. I'll thank you properly after I kill this stupid thing. But yeah, W is for Dead Nasty again. Another 420! Bro, chill! <laughs> chill! I don't know how to fight this enemy. He just does a lot of damage and he attacks a lot. Maybe I have to wait for an opening and then attack during that opening. That might be the strategy. I missed. No! Oh, I dodged too early. Doing this with low adaptability is especially cringe as well. Hmm. This is fine. Don't! Okay, I got damaged there, but he didn't actually grab me. Was that the grab attack? That was supposed to be a grab attack, right? Am I wrong on that? Yeah, Dead Nasty always very generous person. He gives me too much money, honestly. Oh, come on. That's like... I knew it was gonna happen. Yeah, <laughs> I'm stuck on a wall. That attack is fine. Chat, I'm scared. What do I look for in women? Um, I don't have a preference. I mean, I like someone that's funny, I guess. Someone that's intelligent as well. That's pretty cool. And someone that's kind. But that can also joke around and fuck around and stuff. I don't know. Someone that I can vibe with, basically. I don't have a personal preference, though. Why are you trying to get in? He's looking for an int build, yeah. Int dex. 
Because I'm a strength face up again, you know? I need this more variety, more coverage, basically. This fight has been going on way too long, and I need to stop being bad at the game, but I'm like super scared of dying. Oh, it's that one. Oh, that still hit me. Oh, thank god that missed. That was such a bad fight, but we won, so that's all good. Bro's looking for bros? What? Someone with good vibe and is very kind. Fat ass goes a long way too. <laughs> you can't go wrong with a fat ass, that is true. <laughs> I don't have a preference in body type either, but... For me personally, I think the size of it, like all of the size of a booty can be nice. But the one thing that's more important than size, I could probably speak for most guys, is the shape. The shape is more important than the size. That's just me. That's just me. I'm not sure how everybody else feels. But I could do I could do both. I wanted to say yes. Why would you say why would I say no? Alsana's seal is undone, and the winds of Elium Lois are ceased. A good shape over a large square one. You don't like square butts? Well, that was a healthy amount of souls. That's good. <laughs> you don't need a lot of size to throw it back, yeah. What body type? I just said I don't have a specific body type that I like, and you know? I don't care. Okay, so what's the requirements for said curved sword? The curved dragon great sword. But no, wrong one. Curved nail sword. 28 strength. And a scales of strength as well, so I guess we go into strength. That's fine. Um Okay. Um, so surely I have lots of Twinkling Titanites, right? Three. I have three. I have three. Why do I only have three? Where am I getting Twinkling Titanites? I need Twinklings. Where's my Twinkitings? Where do I acquire said Twinks? Okay, I've gotten that one. Um, I didn't pick up that one. Um, did I pick that one up? I don't think so. I didn't pick that one up. Yeah, I didn't pick up that one either. Oh god, I didn't pick up that one. I think I picked that one up. There's not many. There's a bunch in like the Dragon Sanctum. They're all in the DLC. Oh, the Pursuers. Yeah, the Pursuers drop Twinklings, don't they? True. We'll go to the DLC, see how many we can get, and then we can buy, go kill some. Did I pick up the key? I did, didn't I? Yeah. I haven't actually gone to the DLC yet. How does my arms and chest feel? It's actually not even that bad. We've only done 120 push-ups today. That's okay. We've died more times in Dark Souls 1. Although this run is not finished yet, so... We're still in... We're still working on getting some more curved greatswords. Because I kind of want to retire at this one. It's lived out of the I mean, this sword is basically identical to the Mirakuma. There's like no difference. Except for damage, I guess. Scalings. It's prettier and stronger, yeah. It do be having a cooler shape, that is true. Poison is really good in this game, yeah. And it's good when we use it too. 
And like most enemies and bosses are like just weaker to poison. Just... Poison just fucks everything up. Chat, I'm getting hungry. Someone make me food. I guess I'll my water would be good for now. Base version is better, but it's hard to get. The base version of what? I just ate taco pizza, and you didn't give me any. And do you call yourself a real Yui fan? Unbelievable. Which Dark Souls 2 version is better? I don't know. I haven't- I- One of these marathons, I gotta go play the vanilla version, honestly. I just gotta like, download it and stuff, because I have the vanilla version, and I have all the DLCs too. I haven't played it. Frozen water is best to eat. <laughs> Had PB and J. <sighs> okay, um, uh, I'm gonna put that on. Okay, we have enough arrows. Should be good enough. Okay, can I not die here, please? I should have came here earlier to get the Flynn's Ring as well. That would have been like a pretty intelligent move, honestly. I think there's like a bunch of Twinkling Titans there. Hmm. Spicy Sriracha Chicken Sandwich. So now I'm just getting hungry. Um, where is it again? Is it? I feel like there was a twink over there. Am I wrong on that? I forget. Ah, uh, Coco, thank you for the follow, man. I think there is. I think it's behind this wall. I think that one there. I would like to not die, please. Okay, hopefully we can just do this part first try. That'd be great. Thank you, dragon. Favorite weapon OST in the Souls Elden Ring series? Uh, probably... What's his name? Um, Ludwig. I mean, I have like a list of like top 40 best Soulsborne OSTs if you want to check that out. Um, cool. This is okay. There's a bunch of twinks. Like, I think I can get like at least 10 twinkling tide knights here. Well, that was a fucking mistake. Go that way instead. <laughs> I like completely whiffed. I always watch you on YouTube. I thought I could follow you on Twitch as well. Nice. Thank you, man. Wait, is there a twink here as well or no?
That is definitely not a twink. And thank you for stopping by, Coco. Appreciate it, man. Um, yeah, we're gonna get the flint ring. Nice, huge. That's so cool. Stay on Twitch or go back to YouTube. You can do whatever you want. I stream on both platforms, so you guys have a freedom of choice. Um, Twitch, I mean, I think YouTube has the option of like scrolling back on the stream. I think you can. I think you can scroll back on live. You can't do that on Twitch, but I think but Twitch has, I have like more emotes here. And I have like alerts and stuff like that, or sound effects that you could use. I think that's like the only differences. <laughs> Outside of that, use whatever you want. Repair powder. Where am I going? No, we go down. <laughs> we go down. We don't go that way. But I think that's actually more Twinkling Tide Knights that way. Was there Twinkling Tide Knights down that way? I think there was. Fuck it, he cares. Yeah. Aim better. There's no way that missed. How did that miss? Am I late? Maybe. I was doing that attack, fuck. Go get the thing. Get the thing. Wait, it's not even that one, that's the other one. Fuck, I got a mistake. Made a mistake. Then hit this one. What the fuck is that one for then? I don't know. Wait, that one's just for the spikes, true. Don't, 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 I said don't. I said don't. No, don't hit me. No, leave me alone. <laughs> okay, before anything happens, I'm gonna go hit up the um, bonfire. Love the creepy singing? Somebody has to. YouTube steals less money from the streamers, so I watch here. That is true. That is also true. Okay, you're gonna let me open up this chest? Nice. I'm pretty sure there's like a bunch of twinks here, right? Three, cool. Is there something here as well? No. Okay, that should be everything. For this little section. Cool. Benny heal music? <laughs> okay, I put on this. Good old cat ring. If you want to watch Fallout, then go ahead and watch Fallout. It's perfectly fine. <sighs> I got YouTube Premium, so no ads. Tough choice. If you got YouTube Premium, you can just go watch it on YouTube. So, Because <laughs> you're going to get ads here. Unless you pay for a sub. Or get gifted one. Whatever one is more comfortable to you, my friend. I mean, you could just watch it on both if you're a real UE fan, you know? You're telling me that you don't have, like, multiple devices just watching my stream on all platforms all the time? Unbelievable. Running out of life gems, I need more. Hello. 
very cool. Ethereal is gonna mend how things. I'm heartbroken, but I wanna watch Fallout. That's fine. Enjoy your time watching Fallout. I'll have a fantastic time playing Dark Souls 2, which honestly, the playthrough itself hasn't been that bad. Most of my deaths have been by falling off a cliff. So that's been okay. <laughs> it's like I'm in fighting the boss fights pretty bad, you know? Uh, by the way, we're just gonna do any percent because I don't hate my life. Oh, there's a bunch of twinkling tide knights in this area, but I forget like exactly where they are. I forget where exactly where they are. Okay, how many do I have right now? I need literally one more. I need literally one more. That's okay. It's not even this way. Back to the bonfire, run! You're a real one for not running many ads? Um, yes, I don't run much ads, no. I mean, I basically have like the minimum amount playing for, <laughs> for Twitch. I swear there's Twinks somewhere here. Which platform has the Twinks? One of these platforms has it. It's pretty up, it's pretty up top, isn't it? It's probably up top. I literally need one more. I need one more. God fucking damn it. <laughs> I forget! I forget where they are. Where's one that I can pick up that's easy? There's got to be somewhere that's easy. I don't know. There's got to be one here. There has to be one. <laughs> Where is it? Grab the ones in the jump in the forest of the fallen giants. The jump in the forest of the fallen giants? Which one's that one? Oh, no, I didn't pick that one up. No, I didn't. But do I risk making that jump though? Fucking Drake Blood Knights. Mm. All this extra fucking around. I wasn't expecting them to actually fall down and follow me, I'm not gonna lie. I just hit one! Why didn't I just pick them up along the way? I fucking died. God damn it. I did like nothing. I was just walking through, minding my own business. Uh, one of the shaded ruins guarded by the four basilisks. Where is that? 
The shaded ruins? Four basilisks? Iron keep behind the archer captain? Where is the easy ones? Can I just fucking buy one? <laughs> Where you get the bird butt? Is it there? The butt bird. Bird butt. The cannon was on 90 the previous time I was here. When I was playing Dark Souls 1 yesterday. Yeah, now we're um... I was gonna get this stupid weapon, uh, stupid item first. And then I'll go do my 10 push-ups. God fucking damn it. What a silly game. Okay, so it's gotta be somewhere here. Well, now we know where we find Twinkling Titanites. Now we know. Could have just picked up the ones on the way down. Save myself. You're really into Twinks? Yeah, I love Twinks. Okay, now we actually gotta go pick up the weapon. Fuck. Um. We're gonna pick up the weapon. Hopefully we don't die. Because I have a feeling we might die here. So I'm gonna wait a little bit. Before I do another set of push-ups. I put on the Flynn's ring though. Was that a mistake to just aggro everybody? We're fine. I haven't died 270 times, I've died 27 times. Okay. No, yeah, I've died 270 times. There's a fucking NPC. Oh, this is the stupid... Ugh. This is the one that cosplay one, right? Isn't it there between those three giants? How did that hit me? Oh, go away! Every enemy with a shield is like the most toxic thing in this game. Especially the poking attacks. They're so fast! And I'm missing all of my attacks! I'm missing all of my attacks! The tracking in this game is an absolute joke! It's an absolute joke! How am I ever gonna do, like, just one-handed? Why do I keep doing this to myself? Like, with this one, two-handing, it does more damage. Two-handing is way better. It does more damage. It's gonna two-shot them. Doesn't matter if I can do more damage, but I can't even fucking hit the guys. Jeez, man. Vertical swipes in this game are disgusting. Just absolute disgrace. That, that didn't stagger him? That's crazy. <laughs> Pro gamer minus one, yeah. Losing skill as we speak. Oh! Everything's fine. I'm not even mad. I didn't get mad. Didn't even get mad. I'm not even upset. We're gonna buff.
Bro. Oh, that's really good. That's really good. That's really intelligent. Good job. Oh my god. The fact that these enemies don't get staggered with even like a heavy attack makes me want to kill myself. I get hit by everything. I'm just like not dodging anything. I get hit by everything all the time. I get hit by everything. I just never dodge. I, I There's no way I don't get hit. Like it's impossible to not, not get hit. You know what I'm saying? There's like no universe of which I just do not get hit. I'm just always getting a hit. They actually despawned? No way. Actually toggle off. There should be a dedicated heal button. I don't care what anybody says. There should be a dedicated heal button in this game. Fuck you. Why? Why does every enemy get to dodge? Why? Just stay still. That's actually disgusting. See, why do I... Oh my god. What do I fucking do?! <laughs> What do I do? There's two of them and I can't do anything! What do I do? I have to make all three of them move, don't I? I aggroed them. Oh, that was not a mistake. All this for a fucking mid weapon. Holy shit. Just buff again. I'm taking any chances. I've used like all of my materials and all of my willpower. To make sure I wanted to strafe. But you can kill them when they're just idle. I thought you had to aggro them. Could have just baited them downstairs. And I'm still aggroed by the NPC. Oh my god. Are these NPCs stupid? Like, why don't they follow me? You fucking piece of shit. I was waiting for us. Like, where the fuck is it? Why am I bothering? Why am I bothered? <laughs> I need to do all that shit. I already got to do 30 push-ups. 
Why am I bothering? Wasting my time. Well, we have the sword. <laughs> we have the sword. Okay, we have the sword. Okay, 30 push-ups, that's fine. Why did I have to die that many times? It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Very cute. Ooh. That's fine. That's fine. <sighs> Don't forget to smash okay. the like button if you guys are against domestic violence. This is okay. Let's not die anymore. I'm starting to feel it. It's like when you're just doing 10 at a time, it's actually not that bad. <laughs> 30 is pretty cringe. I'll be around. That was a terrible display of skill in the past 20 minutes. <laughs> it did be looking kind of cute. Yeah, I think it's a slower moveset, and it consumes more stamina. Is the one-handed moveset the same? Nah, even that's different, but it is faster though. But I want the spin to win. Hell yeah. Cute as fuck. Beautiful. It is a beautiful blade. Yui is hot. Thank you. I think so too. You know what? You're hot. But this weapon actually does look really cool. Wait, doesn't actually glow? Can I get rid of this and actually be glowing? I need to be in new game. I think it glows when you're in new game, doesn't it? New game plus, I mean. There's like the glow scale. Yeah, the death counter is going from last stream. Speaking of which. We're at 300. We did it. We've officially tied the amount of deaths from Dark Souls 1. Confirmed. Dark Souls 2 harder game. Um, okay. Now let's go. To the undead crypt with our newly found sword. But you can't actually buff this thing, can you? Mmm, that's kind of fucking cringe. Oh, it does a lot less damage. Oh no. <laughs> We're gonna use it though. It can it's probably only buffed with spells, right? Or what? Can it only be buffed with spells? Lightning infusion, that shit. I don't have any faith. We'll just go kill Velstat with this shit. I mean, I do have the Flynn's ring now, so it should be okay. Gonna be looking like Rock at the end of the marathon? I don't think so. I ain't know about all that. Speaking of dying, let's use a human effigy. Look how low I'm running on life gems. I've used so many life gems. Bro, I'm so bad at this game. Well, fuck around. Probably use this thing for like a little bit.
I wonder how much sh um, stamina damage it does to a shield. <laughs> you can't like delay the input. I don't like that. You have to like, if you want to do the follow-up spinning attack, you have to like click it basically before you even finish the animation. Yeah, push-ups for the entire marathon, yeah. See how many times. Be a good way to see how many times you actually end up dying. In one marathon. Yeah, this damage is hot garbage. I wonder how much more damage it gives... Does anyone know how much more damage it gives per new game? I can go like test it out myself. With Cheat Engine, I can just... Change the new game modifier number. Wait, he sells some... Oh, I don't care. Don't need nothing from that guy. Wait, so if I have a lightning infused, or if I have just like elemental infused, I could buff it then? Or no? With spells? Can I be buffed with spells? Wait, isn't there a petrified dragon bone here as well? There's no reason to use the Great Mace over the Great Stars, but it's pretty. Um, well, it does more damage. <laughs> the Great Mace does do higher damage. Move. Spells work. I just gotta go get like a whole ass staff or a stupid chime and... Wait, there's a petrified dragon bone in this room, isn't there? Was it in this room? Or is it here? I forget now. I feel like there was a petrified dragon bone somewhere there. And look who shows their ugly ass head. Let's just rinse and repeat. Nice. <laughs> nice. That's so cool. <laughs> what a funny heavy attack. Gotta love spin to win. Do I mind damage is doo doo. Does it consume much stamina as well? It consumes like less stamina than like the scythe heavy attack, which is actually disgusting. I feel like that was a petrified dragon burn. Could this be joy? <laughs> Maybe. Oh fuck, wrong way. Yeah, I gotta power stance it. But like, I need more strength. Even more strength. No one's gonna follow me, right? You know what? For the sake of the run, let's go drop a chime. Wait, I don't have any faith though. What's my faith at? Six. I can't really use anything. <sighs> Whatever, dude. It can't be spell buffed? You lied to me. So I just need- okay. I mean, a lightning infusion will probably still end up being better. I'll see you, Articule. Thank you for stopping by, man. You have a wonderful sleep, my friend. Ah, uh, Jake, what's going on? How's the run been going? The run has been going somewhat well. Has not been too bad. It could be worse. It could, in fact, be worse. Does it get like an A scaling in Faith or Lightning? I 
I definitely like the moveset of this one. This one is a good moveset. This one probably not being the best curve great sword. Even if it does get less damage in regular new game. Okay, let me just stay at full health because I want to hit him with a charged heavy attack or heavy attack. And again. I don't think the DPS is that good. But he had a hyper armor there, so. Get him. That was worth it. I didn't care. That was worth it. The recovery frame's not even that bad as well. I'm expecting the recovery frames to be way worse. Why can't I, like, dodge these attacks? Maybe because I have very low adaptability. That would make sense. Finish him! Oh no. Finish him! Nice. Hell yeah. That was cool. We're saving that gameplay. For the video. So like, what do I do? Do I go into adaptability or do I go into more strength so I can power stance? What are you doing here? Go away. Sixty-nine thousand souls, nice. Escaling for whatever you infuse it for, damn. This is just gonna be the best curved great sword. I don't know which one I put at number two. I want to try the dragon's curved sword first or next. That is in fact the last one to use. So. There's not many bosses left. Um, okay, now how many petrified dragon bones do I have? I have seven. And I can go farm the next area, and that can give me a decent amount. That's cool. I think this scales off strength, and I have a more dexterity. As you can see. I think at this point, I could probably power stance. Adaptability. Jeez. <laughs> the L2 is just a spin. It's just like the- it's like the follow-up spin, but it just does it first. Um... Consume all of these. All of these. I have a sublime burn dust. Yeah, Noble Elto is a power, yeah. I think you actually get more parry frames with the Curve Greatsword. More than like a regular weapon. Um, adaptability? 95, I need 96 agility, don't I? Am I wrong on that? Let me go. <laughs> agility, DS2, I always forget. Yeah, nice. So it's 92 agility, the 96. I was at 91. Oh, I did it wrong. I need 96 agility. Um, where am I gonna get 5,000 souls from? This thingy. Cool. Ninety-six agility. Thank God, I have two more iframes. So I was having nine iframes the entire run. That's crazy. <laughs> what can you do? Now we have... That should be just as much as, like, some other games. Maybe Dark Souls 3 Light Roll. Should find another curve. <laughs> Wait. I need... 
how much strength do I have? I only have 30 strength, right? Yeah, I can't even power stance if I wanted to. Kind of just put it like a regular curve slot on the offhand, and then I'm still gonna meet the requirements. Fuck. I can't power stance this thing. How much strength is that? I need like 40 strength. That sucks. We're gonna kill the stupid dragon for this thingy, and then we'll go switch to the other sword. Yeah. Rip the power stancing dream. That's unfortunate. I could probably power stance the regular curve great swords. Okay, now where am I going? We have the king's ring. I'm pretty sure how many petrified dragon bones can I get on Aldius Keep? I think I can get like four or five, and I think if I just use a I'll just keep. I, I can farm this area. I think I have something different. I thought there was more. I thought there was like fourth something in there. I might be wrong. <laughs> the emerald arrow dumped five. <laughs> it's fine. We don't need a power stance. Maybe for the last boss. Dark Souls is my first Souls game. Seeing this makes you want to replay it. Maybe you should. Maybe you should. Okay, King's Ring. I needed more, um... Life gems. It is in fact what I need. There's not many bosses left. I don't think I'm gonna do some of the DLC, honestly. So there's one there, and there's another one inside, and there's one in the corrosive pool. I might do a couple of DLC bosses. I do have like a lot of the DLCs unlocked, so I can do some of the bosses. Probably from the first and second DLC, I'm not gonna fight. <sighs> the duo cats, or the um... What's his name? Ivory King. I mean, I wanna fight the Ivory King, but I just... You just need to actually go get the stupid soldiers. Otherwise it's like a GG. Come on. Stay still. That's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. Wait, how many... I have four bonfire aesthetics, that's good enough. Wait, why'd I go this way? I don't know. Because I can't go that way, that's why. That makes sense. Because I can get that one. I'm not sure if the one in the next area, you can't... That's not the same bonfire, it's a different bonfire. But I can go grab it as well. Is there those are only two in this area? That you can farm? Is there another one? I feel like there's another one. Nine petrified dragon birds, so I can get that one there. I'm not bothered. Where's the shit engine? <laughs> Seems like the play. Thank you, Ogre Man.
Get up. I don't like how it consumes more stamina though, I'm not gonna lie. Where is he even breathing fire? I don't understand. Where is he going? Confuse the fuck out of me. Stupid buggy ass fight. Can you get down here, please? Oh, come on. How long does that fire have to last? Holy shit. Which weapons do I plan to use for Elden Ring? All of them. Playing with all the curved greatswords. Stop with the flying. It's unnecessary. You, my friend, are annoying. Oh, there's no way. <laughs> Look at this thing's health. Fall down, please. We did it. First try. Now we go speak to this stupid big dragon, then we can go finish the game. Still got a while left? Nah, not really. We got like two bosses left. I was gonna kill the giant lord. Probably gonna kill it with this next up and then I'm gonna get and then I probably just kill the last couple bosses. Call it a day. Probably kill the DLC bosses in my spare time. To get gameplay for the video. I feel that Dark Souls 3 run is going to be pretty cool. I think one of the Dark Souls 3 weapons... I think it's of a Covenant, right? I'm pretty sure it's of a Covenant. There's a bunch of petrified dragon bones here too. We got enough. Thoughts on the Vendrick boss fight? I think the Vendrick boss fight is a cool atmospheric moment and it serves its purpose in being so. Um, I don't think it's meant to be anything else. Like obviously mechanically it's fucking shit, but like it's not meant to be a good boss, so to speak. Yeah, the old wolf curve sword, yeah. Now that I'm thinking about the old wolf curve sword, the weapon skill is very similar to the Bloodhound Fang, right? The Bloodhound Fang weapon skill is very similar to that one. I just realized that. It's like the same first part of the animation. The follow-up is like a bit different though. That's right. Forgot about that. Ah, uh, let's just go. We're gonna kill these guys. Kill the guys along the way. Wow. Um, curved greatswords are meta in Dark Souls 3? I don't know if they're meta. I think the straight swords are definitely meta in Dark Souls 3. Um, but curved greatswords are still good though. I mean, Curve Greatswords are good in every game.
I love how much this guy attacks. It's really cool. The magma swords and Elden Ring outside of how the farming was. Just a downgraded to the demon skull. I mean, yeah, it gets more damage than the demon skull. But... Hold on, buddy. That was close. Heavy attack time. Oh, don't, 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 don't. No. No. You're doing 10 right now. Good enough. Esther saved then choke, yeah. I don't feel like the heavy attack, and the heavy attack just fucking missed. It went in a fuck off location. Oh, God. These guys have too much poise, and they keep attacking, and they overswing, and I don't like that. Die. One handed strats. Nice. But yeah, like, the demon scar damage is kind of ass, but like, it's obviously, no. It's a weapon catalyst, so therefore it's cool. It gets a pass. There's no way he's still alive. That was close. <laughs> so we died again, didn't we? 310. Add it, add it to the list. We officially died more times in Dark Souls 2 than Dark Souls 1. Officially. Oh, I could've hit him again. Oh, he stayed still. Nice. Bro, Dark Souls 2 is just way too long. Like, there's so many bosses. Like, I'd like to do all bosses runs, but like, they're just- it's just so long and- just draining and time consuming and a lot of the bosses are just so shit. <laughs> okay, is it gonna stagger him? Oh jeez. That's fine. Let me just get my shit back. Okay, let me get this heavy attack off. That's fine. That's not fine. That's bullshit. That's really cool. Are you enjoying the through so far? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. It's great. How's the run going? It's great. 310? Well, like, dating back to yesterday, yeah. But we officially died more times in this game than Dark Souls 1, so that's cool. Died twice here in this location. There is no way this thing is still alive. Look at that health. I can, like, tickle his nutsack and he will die. What the fuck? We've died, what's that, 16 times? Or 17 now? That's cool. What? I wanted to... It's the worst thing about this weapon. You can't delay the follow-up. I don't like that. Poor guy, we're doing fine. My body's handling it okay. There's been like instances where like I died like three times in a row, then I had to do like 30 push-ups in one sitting, and that was kind of shit, but... It is what it is. Please just fucking die. Anyway, how are things with you, Ally? Hope you're doing well. So you're a fake Yui fan and only want to appear at the end of the run, where the glory happens? Are you gonna do a Dragonfall Marathon? I mean, if there was like a transformation for like, Elden Ring, then um... That's nice, that does dog shit damage. Looks like we're gonna backstab farm. That's the only way. Is backstab farm. Oh, the tracking. It's doo doo. 
We can win this. Stay still. Get him out of here. Huge damage. And if there are transformations on Elden Ring, I'd do a transformation marathon. It's so similar to like the Hand of Millennia. How like you try to delay the input to do the follow-up attack and it doesn't work. You have to click it straight away. I don't like that. Episode was amazing. Nice. It's a dragon. That looks cool and that's about it. It's fish. What's fish? Yes, fish man is here, yes. <laughs> so what fish are we talking about? Cool, did I get the thing? I think I got the thing. Yeah, I got the thing. Now I'm not fighting the dragon. The boss fight sucks. We're good. We're good. I'm back for good, aren't you happy? You've left me so many times, I now have abandonment issues and I'm basically crying right now. I gotta do 10 push-ups still, fuck. UE TTS inflation is crazy lower the price of TTS. Okay, cool. I've had worse days. We're at 320 push-ups for the marathon. I'm not bothered to run to stupid Freya's place, so what we're gonna do is use cheat engine. We have the soul, or the ability to get the soul. Let's go drop it. Ah, uh, it's a Cordigan Curved Dragon Sword. We're at that part of the SUV run where I give up. TTS inflation is crazy low, the price of TTS seriously WTF. Who the fuck's yapping? I can't tell. <sighs> you know what? Like, we're so close to just removing TTS altogether. So it's either you have it more expensive, or we just don't have any TTS. <sighs> Do you think it'll be at 500 by the end? I hope not. We only have two games left. Okay, how heavy is this fucking thing? It's a lot shorter than the other ones. I don't like weapons that are just really big. Four 18 units. I mean, the... The curved Neil Sword is 17 units. Actually, they actually were really heavy. What the fuck? They weigh a lot. That's kind of cringe. 60 durability. That's 50. That's fine, I guess. I should be better in Dark Souls 3 and Elden Ring. So I don't think we can get to... I don't think we get to 500. Unless I play, like, absolute doo-doo trash. Um... We'll go spec into Endurance. Okay. Cool projectile attack. Fantastic. That consumes an absolute metric fuck ton of durability. And I have one repair powder. We can fix that. We can fix that. It is no longer an issue. Where am I going? We're going to the forest. I gotta mow the dishes. Might take four to six months. Fuck, why did I alt tab? I ruined my sleep schedule to watch your streams. Not a... <laughs> what? I don't recommend ruining your sleep schedule. Am I ruining your, like, work or something like that? Or school, whatever you do? I hope not. Yeah, and I'm going back to the shitty-ass moveset. That's disgusting. I don't want this dog shit moveset. Use soldier's key. It does a projectile one-handed as well, right? How much damage does it do? So it does ass damage, that's confirmed. Really cool. Love that. Three, 
339 damage. I'm sorry, what? That one just straight up just missed. Okay. And then a backstab does a lot more. What about a point blank heavy attack? Okay. So I think Fallen is just very tanky. That's all it is. The sword is at risk. Repair powder. <sighs> this weapon sucks? Yeah, it could be worse. <laughs> could be worse. Let's just go kill this stupid ass giant. She blocked it too? Fair enough. More of a wake up tool in PvP. Bro, how do I say your name? It's like in Korean, right? I don't know. What do I call you? Like, if I have to refer to you? What the fuck do I say? I just- I should've just been more patient. I wasn't expecting to get hit by a big-ass fucking projectile. I should have just been more patient. I don't know what I was thinking. Why am I like this? Cause like you can't see the giant do the projectile attack when the whole arena is covered in smog and the stupid fog and you can't see anything. And I was like, I was just waiting for it to go away. I was like, okay, now I can go because surely it's gonna disappear, right? Surely I can be able to walk through that place and actually see what the fuck's going on. No, you have to wait a little bit longer. Confirmed. Translation is Dung Su Kim. Kim it is. That was unlucky, that was just a Yui moment, honestly. We gotta wait a little bit longer. Okay, now we can go. That's fine, I don't care that I took damage as long as I can actually see what the fuck's happening. So I can dodge that attack. Jeez. So I did about 500 and some damage. What about a heavy attack? 522? Huh? Oh, I know why, because it's doing it's hitting him twice. So it's still doing some nice damage. That's fine. That's okay. Let me just heal up. Okay, let me just hit you with this. Okay, 365 damage. I don't feel like it hits enemies multiple times. Probably not. Repair powder, go! Well, he's dead. It's okay. Like, it can still serve as a projectile attack. It's not bad. Maybe some bosses is good for. Maybe, like, the Throne Watcher and Defender could be good for. I think consuming a lot of durability is kind of mid. Made this weapon as an Inu Yasha fan. Is it? Why is that? Curved Greatsword moveset in this game seems a lot better than Dark Souls 1. I mean, the thing is, the Dark... I mean, the Curved Greatsword moveset and Dark Souls 1 is basically the exact same thing as a regular Curved Sword, just slower. It's like basically identical. Um, and I probably like that one more. The one-handed moveset here is better. The two-handed moveset and Dark Souls 1 is better. Unless you're talking about the Cursed or the Curved Nil Sword, then that one's better. That one's pretty cool. Uh, we don't need Dexterity right now. What do I go spec into? I don't know. Vitality? I don't know. Vigor, whatever. <laughs> Neil Ark Murakumo Dragon? Yeah, probably. 
probably be interesting to see where they rank in the grand scheme of things throughout all the games. Like, because at the moment, there hasn't been, like, a single Curve Great Soul that I've played with that's actually, like, sucked, you know? <laughs> um... Wait, did I die? I had to do push-ups, right? I did die, didn't I? Yeah. Yeah, they can like block the entire fucking thing. That's so mid. I almost died there. That's fucked up. I died a lot. Yeah, I've died... What, 18 times this playthrough? That's not the worst thing in the world. I was fully expecting to die... About twice that amount. There's still time, yeah, true. We're using a shitty ass weapon. I can buff this thing there, right? Like, I can buff it, right? I should be able to buff it. I can, cool. I haven't been buffing it. Okay, the damage can be better. I'm not sure if, like, the projectile attack scales up it, though. Probably not. Server alone? No. But not doing any- <laughs> Not doing any more push-ups. No more DLC. <laughs> we'll end on a high. I mean, that's pretty good. It goes through enemies. I like that. Oh, there's so many enemies that can block attacks. That's good. That's actually good. DLC or bust? Bust what? <laughs> I mean bust. Yeah, whatever. Whatever bust is, yeah, I'm doing bust. I guess a nice hyper armor too. Fucking. It's, it's just like oh oh. Ugh. Duo bosses do not should not be in Dark Souls too. That's. Pure fucking reason right there. The fact that you get stun locked like that is a fucking disgrace. Even with the amount of poise that I have. I don't have much poise, but I still have... I should have enough. I'll do them after I kill the boss. Do them in the cutscene. Still the king zone. Should have had this one instead. Fucking disgusting. How do I rank the nil slot? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna head out. I'm sleepy and feeling sad. Oh, Sorry for feeling that way, Ribbit. Hope you cheer up. I'll try better tomorrow to cheer you up. Hopefully I'm in a better mood when I play Dark Souls 3. You guys have a wonderful sleep, and thank you for all the support and the $10 as well. W for Ribbit. It's the much better game, so hopefully. <laughs> Huge damage. Heal. Projectile attack. Get him. Get him. That hit me? I 
I don't like these guys. That's good damage right there. Oh, look at him get staggered for that long. Oh, you fucked it up. Why do so many enemies dodge in this game? Fuck. I can't repair that, can I? Fuck. Hot swap. That was not even close. I didn't want to use all of my floss there, I wanted to use like just two. And I spammed it like three times. <laughs> Whatever. Looks like we're killing this boss with this thingy. <sighs> Things more likely Elden Ring 2 or a second DLC after Shadow of the Earth Tree. I think a second DLC is more likely, although I think that there is no chance of any of them happening. I think if we're gonna get an Elden Ring 2, it'll be like 10 years from now. I just don't see it happening. I see them retiring the Souls formula. I don't see them doing it again. No hit first try? True. I just hit a Sigma Ohio Gritty. Are you proud? Yeah, cool. I'm proud of you. I think Elden Ring is going to be like the last traditional Souls game. I think we're going to move on. I think we're moving on at this point. What would be next? I don't Probably like a new formula. Probably like, you know, some, like, Sekiro formula. Probably not Sekiro exactly, but like, you know. They'll probably change things up how, like, Sekiro changed up from the regular formula. Something like that. So I don't doubt the next game will have, like, deflecting or, like, some crazy-ass stuff. I just don't see it playing the same way as the Souls games. How did that fucking hit me? You disgust me. Didn't I dodge? I clicked the dodge button. I gotta go repair my weapon. I must repair it. I gotta save that gameplay. Fucking god damn it. <laughs> It didn't even give me like a warning for when I broke the weapon. It just fucking broke it. It was like, there's not like warning beforehand. It's like, hey, look, it's about to break. It was like, you're now fucking broken. Piece of shit. Fuck you. Yeah, I gotta do 30 fucking push ups. Yeah, I know. I was like, just. Just doing this shit first. I'll do them when I like the cutscene is playing. I want to beat the game. I need to get P as well. I'm not bothered to do it right now. <laughs> Hopefully we don't die again. Otherwise I gotta do 40. Which... 40 in one sitting is not cool. Sci-Fi Secular. That'd be cool. They made the best Souls combat system that didn't make it replayable and didn't give it a DLC. Yeah. Well, like, the good thing is about that is that now they have plenty of ideas. The fact that it just didn't make a sequel, didn't make a DLC, didn't make it that much... Didn't make it have that much build variety at all means that if they keep using the Souls formula for Secular, or like a Secular type of formula, they could go super hard. There's like, it's such an untapped potential. So much untapped potential. And with From Software, like, with how creative they can be, it's not gonna just be like, you know, a Lies of P type of deal, how it's just gonna add a deflect mechanic to a Souls game. They're probably gonna change things up a lot. They have the potential to make some really cool and different stuff. They're very talented. They don't need to go make the same game every fucking year. They don't need to. Um, cool. I 
I never said that Liza Peel is a bad game. Did I say Liza Peel is a bad game? I don't think I did. I could do this all day. Oh, for fucks, like that just what like this makes no sense. Make the hitbox the hitbox, you know? Make the model the hitbox. Don't do anything extra. It makes no sense. We got this. Like, what the fuck is this bullshit? You know what? You can keep doing that attack. I don't care. I got projectiles. What are you gonna do about it? It actually goes really far. W boss fight? We're popping off right now. Yeah, the, the reason why I said that Liza P comment is because Liza P doesn't really add much different in terms of combat. It's just like the same as all the other Souls games, the combination of it. Which is why, like, you know... There's a point as what I was trying to make, is that FromSoft can make something with a deflex mechanic, but not just have a Souls formula. They could pre make it something different. They could build upon Sekiro. Is she stupid? Like, if I'm hitting you with projectile attacks, you gotta, like, do something. And of course, no warning yet again. I wasn't paying attention. What a terrible boss fight. This is the final boss. And the funny thing is, they literally made, like, a new update with Scholar of the First Sin. And added another final boss. And they made it worse. <laughs> like, how do you, like, you know, just, like, rectify this and try and make a different final boss. And you make Aldia, which is a great fucking character. But they made the boss fight even worse. It's so bad. <laughs> do you think Elden Ring has a chance of being the best game we've got to play? It's your favorite game? Um, maybe, I don't know. It's just, I mean, pro what your favorite game is is what your favorite game is. And it's all personal preference. I like Dark Souls 3 the best because I had the most fun playing it back in the day. That's basically my criteria. You who link the fire. Um, for make a game competes with Liza P Victorian era Souls game, isn't Bloodborne Victorian era? Souls will flourish in you, and all of this and I'd like them to do like a brand new aesthetic. Different aesthetic. Anyway, we're gonna do 30 push-ups now. That's cool. And then we're gonna go do something else. I don't know, we'll see. Well, we beat the game, that's all that matters. 30. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That one's feeling fucking shit. That hurt. Light work. Easy. Oh god. Let's not keep dying in this marathon, please. Okay, if my arms weren't hurting tomorrow, or in today, they're gonna be hurting tomorrow. First video game that I played? <sighs> I don't know, probably like... Something on the PS1. <laughs> When I was a kid. PS1 demo. Now, eight minutes of unskippable cutscenes. Hell yeah. So we finished with 350 push. We finished Dark Souls 2. Okay, so we died. How many times is that? 
We died 20 times. We died 20 times. <sighs> God. There's still a FromSoft hurdle. What's the hurdle for today? I want to mute the fucking game. Because the game's getting in the way. How do I mute the game? Like if I minimize the game, why is it still making sound? Don't cheat this time. Is that Onsen and Smo? That was not Onsen and Smo. <laughs> Cleric bees? I don't think so. Doesn't even come up there. I don't know. Rowan Sentinels? <laughs> I don't know. Medir? That doesn't help me at all. Is like the one reborn there? No. <sighs> I have no fucking clue. Was it Sir alone? <laughs> Sif. It's not Sif. It's not Sif. I don't know! Watchdog of the Old Lords? It's not even fucking here. The fuck is Watchdog of the Old Lords? Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Penetrator. Actually, it does sound similar to Alant. I'm not gonna lie. It does sound similar to Alant. Is it Chalice Dungeon theme? There's no like fire dog. There's nothing. There's nothing for the watchdog. There's nothing for a talus dungeon boss. I don't know. I was gonna say a lot. I don't care. Um, which one? It was fucking 
Bloodborne. What the fuck is Terra? So you're probably right. Why do they call it Terra? Who is that off? It is the Watchdog. So you were right, that was the Watchdog. But like, it didn't say it. It didn't come up as an option. I don't know why it doesn't come up as an option. Unless they use it multiple times. Did they use that multiple times? It's probably used multiple times. It's probably why they didn't put Watchdog. That's just fucking stupid. That's just dumb. Why do they call it Terra? Meanwhile, the credits are still playing. Disgusting game. That's fine. <sighs> anyway, we're done for today. We are done. I don't think the theme's exclusive to the Watchdog. Maybe not. That's probably why they called it Terror. I don't actually... I don't know. Clearly, I don't do much Chalice Dungeons. <laughs> Clearly not. Anyway, um, thank you everyone for stopping by. We'll be on tomorrow with Dark Souls 3. Continue on with the push-up marathon. <laughs> Basically, it's what it's turned into. I um, hope you guys have a wonderful night, morning, day, whatever it is. And I hope to catch you guys around. Bye. See yous.